Hello, friends. Oh my God, can you hear me? Can, can you hear me? I'm having some like tech issues. This is not the stream I want to have tech issues for. Oh my God, oh, what is my luck? What is my luck? Yee, 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 Oh my God, chat, I have some terrible news. My game is lagging and so is my PC. Ah! <laughs> this is, this is not good. This is not good. I'm like, I'm like mass closing things on my PC right now in an attempt to get shit going. If I have to, I may have to just like reboot the game, which is fine. I don't mind having to do that, but oh my God. Is the stream okay? Like, are we good? Are we chilling? <laughs> no, no, we won't get them next time. We're getting them now. No. <laughs> Stream seems good? Okay, great. Keep me updated on like lag and whatever else. Hi friends, how's everybody doing? How are we all? How's everyone? I'm having a day. I'm honestly, I'm honestly not having a good day. My day is kind of garbaggio, so I'm really excited to play Final Fantasy 14. I almost said 16. I'm very, very stoked to be back in Eorzea. Days about to get better. I hope so. I hope I don't cry. That's all I hope for. I need to get my lipstick. Uh, I just realized I don't have any of my goods at my station. One second. I'm running. Okay, I made it in one piece, hello. Oh, oh boy, that lag. No, no joking about it. You have to only be serious, okay? So I'm just going to go under cameras, the lights at her window, and <laughs> some beautiful, awesome people in chat. I know, can you believe that it's like actually daytime still and I'm live? Hello, is it pronounced Kira? Kira, hello, hello. Hi, hiker. I'm not making you cry, but I'm hoping you cry if that makes sense. You're, you people are awful. All right, here's the going live tweet. Go reply to it. Your girl is falling off and we can't let that happen. We cannot let this happen, okay? Oh, but how's everybody doing today? I hope everyone is having an infinitely better day than I am. My day has just been like mad slow. It's been, where is my, my mirror fell yesterday during yesterday's stream, right? It's been like mad slow. All I did really was watch Vampire Diaries and hate myself for it. That show is not good, but like I can't put it down either. It's like a guilty pleasure. And most of the time I don't feel guilty about my pleasures. You know, I embrace the shitty content that I consume, but this show is genuinely so bad that I'm embarrassed to still be watching it. I pronounced it right? Wait, so it's Kiera? Or was it Kira? Number one or number two? Girl, you're too fine to fall off. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Hi, K Buzz. Hello. The outfit, the hair, OMG. It's a daytime side stream. Hello, Velas. How are you? I didn't make it to Amarker before you got back, but I'm basically there. You know what? And that's what matters. Because by the time I even get like deeper into it, you're still going to surpass me. Like, I just know it. <laughs> I'm going to be going at a snail's pace. The previews all say 403 Forbidden. Are you kidding? It'd be like that. Yes, number one. Fuck yeah, I'm so good at this. Sarah loves Sarah loves Sarah loves Sarah. <laughs> I'm so good at pronouncing names. You know why? Because no one can pronounce mine. So I've gotten exceptionally good at pronouncing other people's. How has it been a year already? Matt Finn, it's been over a year. It's been 13 months. Isn't that wild? Gino, thank you for the 14 month resub. I appreciate it. Time for an end walk. We're walking till the end. Hello, dentist. Hello. It's because we bullied Ava into doing the Eden and Near Raids first. <gasps> wait, ha wait, Ava, you did the Near Raids? Yeah, Dead Mangle, thank you for the 14 guys. months. I appreciate Pepper it. And thank you for the 100 videos to satisfy. Yes, Pepper hype train. Pepper is back. Pepper is back. Oh. Ah! 
I'm so, uh, I'm so excited. You started the Eden raids? Okay, can I, can I join you for them? Cause I actually love them and I've gotten kind of good at them. I obviously like haven't done like the savage raids or anything like that, but, but I have gotten pretty, pretty good at, at, at them. Pepper never left. Pepper was always here in spirit. But only in spirit. Hello, Kelsey. And who else is here? Let me let me go through my hellos. Let me say all my highs and, and he is in hoes. Kuya, hello, Shadow. It's nice to see you. Hi, Soren. Hi, still cold. Hi, Lockhart. O M fucking G. True. I also say the same thing when I see me. O M fucking G. Fosk, hi! Hello, Chan Fried Rice. Thank you for tuning. Thank you. Amiri, hello, and Shabatron, it's nice to see you again. Hello, Ken, how you doing? Goose, it's nice to see you too. Hi, Baconator. <coughs> Oh, and I think oh and Minfloza, hello as well. K Buzz, hello. And I think I'm like pretty much like caught up now. What's your top expansion trailer music? Shadowbringers, maybe? I mean the Endwalker one is kinda high, but it might be Shadowbringers. Hi, Kate! Yeah, Final Fantasy 14 is back. I feel I feel cleansed. I feel home. I'm so excited. Y'all don't get it. Y'all don't understand. I have missed this game so much. I really, really have missed playing FF14. I miss the community like a ton. <coughs> Dentist, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it to everybody who gifted a sub. Everybody who got gifted a sub to everybody who got, oh wait, that is English. Everybody that, to all the new subs, welcome to the Covenant of True Vegemus and your stay. I really need to fix this like lag issue that I'm having though in game. Here, I'll give y'all a quick preview of it. Oh shit, my cam is gone. I forgot. Fuck, I forgot. I forgot I don't have a camera anymore. Let me just, let me just quickly, let me just quickly bring in my camera. <laughs> Hold on, chat. There we go. Ah! Where'd it go? <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? There we go. Okay, yeah, like, look at this. I'm, oh my God, I'm not, I can't even move. Hello? Oh my God, did my controller just, did my controller just DC? Oh, there's no, chat? There's no shot. There's no shot. Oh, fuck me. Oh my God. Chat, chat, this is not going well. Why did my controller DC? It never DCs. It's always plugged in. The light is always on. How did it only now like just. <sighs> my controller had problems when I started too. You did this. Oh my God, my controller actually isn't working. This is not good. My game just crashed. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. I'm actually gonna cry. I'm actually gonna cry. I just want one fucking thing to work. Okay, the controller is back on. Slay. Controller is on. <laughs> Chat, can we like get like a like a summoning circle or something? Can we all pray really quickly? I need prayers. I need prayers in the chat right now. I need all the prayers. I need all the prayers. Oh my God, my game is not booting up. What is happening? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Hello, Keys. Hi, Holly. Hello. Antoine Bell, how you doing? <coughs> oh my god, my game is literally not booting up. I'm actually about to start crying. Everything was fine until I started streaming. Oh my god. I'm having such a bad anxiety attack now. Oh my god, do I have to reboot my stream? Steam isn't opening.
I hate this. No, my graphics are not Kelsey. And my PC just sucks. My PC is actually just garbage. Hi, David. Hello, hello. Yeah, I know how to reboot Steam. My PC is just garbage, guys. Don't worry. This isn't the first time Final Fantasy XIV has failed me. My PC literally just sucks. Don't worry. I, I got this. I got this. Let me cook. Yeah, let me cook. Let me cook. Okay. Well, I can go back to the main screen now because I got it. I got it loading. This see, like this is why people say do not get Final Fantasy XIV on Steam. But no one told me that until I already got it. So like I'm fucked. Um. Okay. Ah. Here's hoping that the game doesn't lag though, and here's hoping I don't DC. I haven't had a DC in a hot minute though, so we actually might be in the clear. Yo, my authentication code is 007. That's a good sign, right? Yo, Grits, what's up? Have we tried offering the PC words of encouragement? Oh my God, you're such a good girl. You are such a good girl. I believe in you. Oh my God, you're doing so good, honey. Oh my God, yeah, just like that. Just like that, PC. That's the stuff. We did it. We did it. <laughs> We're good. Everything is good. Everything is fine. Everything is dandy. Words of encouragement always work. You're right, Keith. Carlton, what's up? Hello, hello. Oh, my goodness. May the power of mommy compel you. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we're all good. Now I just have to make sure that peppermint isn't lagging and then we're peachy. And then we are peachy. I also need to get some water. My throat is like really irritated today. Like I said, today is just not going well. <laughs> oh man, she broke my curse. I underestimated your strength and resolve. I'm powerful. I may be small, but I'm mighty, okay? Never doubt me, ever, ever. <laughs> All right, okay. Let's make sure that that pepper is in good hands. I'm gonna go grab some water. This is what is going on here. Let me make this look a bit bigger. And let me move chat because chat is like weirdly sized. There we go. Rock. One second. Um, whoever's like still at the FC, just run around to see if there's any lag. tiny spike but we're chilling we ball we're good everything is fine and dandy oh i love this for me i love this for me oh but yeah hi friends who's excited for more endwalker i the last place we left off was literally the um this is sankran mission <laughs> like it's been that long it's been that long since I played. This is Thancred. This is Thancred. Does this come with more Syra crying? This does. This actually does. Today might be a sad day. <laughs> it's the return of my Mikote ears. It's the return of Endwalker. Ah! It has been like a hot minute. <coughs> I also may or may not have told Jones you're back. Oh, is he gonna make an appearance? 
I don't know anything about this game. Wait, do you actually know nothing about Final Fantasy 14? Am I gonna be your intro to the critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Fantasy 14 with a free trial up to Stormblood now, apparently? With no cap on playtime? No cap or restriction on playtime? I know, I uh, I saw or I sent some mail to uh, Action Star Jones the other day and he told me he's here again. That's where I stopped when I took a year long hiatus last time. Is that like where everyone just takes a break? It does get intense. Like that part of Endwalker was very intense and it felt like right to take a break, you know? <coughs> the mommy of the coven has returned, but I'm still not mommy anymore. Like I'm still not mommy in um in the uh in the FC. It's so funny. You're unaccustomed to the acclaimed nature of the MMO. Can you believe that? Shabatron, is like is Final Fantasy like something that you're interested in? Is that a like a game series that you like? Do you like MMOs? Because, boy, let me tell you, this game has changed my life. I it's this was my first Final Fantasy game. Um, and I couldn't put it down when I started playing. It's genuinely so 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 good and this game is free for a very long time so you can take advantage of it you know you can try it out and see how you feel before you actually subscribe and you can unsub whenever you want to which is beautiful you do not get penalized for that <coughs> hi Zerch. hello hello i'm good i'm good I also gave the mommy a mummy for her return. Oh my God. Oh my God, wait. Yeah, you did give me a mummy. You did give me a mummy. Do I, do I even have it? Like, is that something that I already possess? Let me see. Oh, it is. <laughs> but it's cute. I'll keep it. I'll keep it. What if we like getting penalized? Then this might not be the game for you unless you like um, ERP extreme raid progression <laughs> one sec i just have to fix something there we go oh because i changed the ui to standard to make sure that like my um my stream wouldn't lag <coughs> i can't fix it unless i reboot and we're not doing that again hi shaman hello unless you own a house then you're held captive to subscribe forever oh my god so we have an fc house and because like i haven't played in literally four ever it got it was um given to another uh wait hello what am i doing it was given to uh, um my in-game husband <laughs> so we're we're chilling you get two expansions for free that's fire yes the second expansion is really good. Heaven's Ward is my favorite. Stormblood is kind of weak, but the expansion after that is literally mind blowing. I think one of the best like narrative experiences I've ever gone through. Have I been saying penalized the wrong way all these years? Am I saying it wrong? I think it's penalized, like penis. Or is it, is it penalized? No, it's penalized. Hello, Pro Sauce. I hope you enjoy your subby. Hi, Titanics. I forgot where we left off in the game last stream. So last time we played, we were playing a Stankred. So we just made it to Ilsabard. Garlamar, Labalaba. <laughs> it can be either. Well, I prefer Peen. Stormblood has the best post game, in my opinion. Post Stormblood is actually pretty good. I can, I I'll admit that. I may be a Stormblood hater, but I, I can agree to on that one. I don't know how you could get to that pre-Shadowbringers cliffhanger and not immediately dump all your cash. Well, this is what I'm saying, right? Like, the game is so good. Even the boring parts, like even parts of the game that I didn't enjoy, it kept me wanting more. <coughs> Garlababalabar? Yeah, Garlababalabar. The quest that we're on right now is called a frosty reception. So whatever that fucking means. <laughs> Oh, I, I'm literally like, I can't stop smiling. Just the idea that I'm going to be doing MSQ has me fucking buzzing. 
I'm worried that we're gonna get another dungeon. I'm scared. Like, I'm excited, but I'm scared. <laughs> I can't hate Stormblood because that's where all my husbando content is true. I mean, that's how I feel with Heaven's Word, right? But Heaven's Word is really good, so, you know. <laughs> I'm gonna put my comfy coat back on. It's gonna be CRD. What is CRD? <coughs> we got Slutty Vosk in the game. We love to see it. Slutty Vo, rather. Oh. <sighs> Yeah, I'm very excited to get through Endwalker because what that means is like now I can start thinking about more pepper lore. Which excites me because I haven't been able to really create any lore for my Warrior of Light because not continuing the MSQ has honestly truly held me back. Because I don't want to make lore that I may have to change later. Do you know what I mean? Excited that you're excited. Thank you. Scared of dungeons? Anxiety is real. It's not that I have anxiety. It's just like I get overwhelmed very quickly. I love tanking. Don't get me wrong. I will wall to wall any fucking day. You know? My problem is if I'm like queued up with randoms and then they bully me. I don't want to get fucking bullied because I'm the tank, you know? I just don't want to be bullied when I don't ask for it. I like Stormblood mainly for music and vibes. I mean, the vibes are pretty good. I just wish the narrative was better. I feel like I didn't appreciate Heaven's War enough because I was in a rush to get to Stormblood or Shadowbringers when it launched. That's fair. I appreciated Heaven's Ward a little too much to the point where I cried so hard that Final Fantasy XIV noticed me. Square Enix noticed me. <laughs> My gunbreaker is actually at level 89, guys. Look how close it is to to 90. I'm very fucking excited. I am so excited to finally uh, hit 90 on another tank. I am a Dark Knight main, though. I will always play Dark Knight. Warrior is dangerously close to becoming my main. Ooh, I have yet to even try Warrior. I think I'm still... Wait. Wait. It's Warrior and Paladin. Those are the other two, right? And they start off as... Oh, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot what the other um, classes are. Hold on. Let me see. Because I haven't, like, finished leveling them. What is it? Marauder. It's Marauder and... What's the other one? What's the other one? Is the other one literally just... Gladiator? Gladiator, that's it. Do I not have Gladiator unlocked? Oh, no, I do. It's at the very fucking bottom. Okay, my bad. <clears throat> Tank wants to be bullied. It's our de degradation kink. Stop. You're right, but don't be so loud. Jives. Is it pronounced Jives? Jeeves? Jives? Hello. Darkhead is main, but I like Paladin and Gunbreaker. Not so much Warrior since Heaven's Ward. I honestly... Bats! Hello. Less Thank you for... Three. Thank you for the 18 month reset. How are you, beautiful? 18 months? Holy shit, has it actually been that long? How are you? Um, also hi Nanosphere. I don't really like Gunbreaker. I mean, it's fun. I do I do like it. I do like playing it, but I always feel like I'm lagging when I play it. Like it just doesn't feel smooth. Oh, Orem Vale? You mean the piss dungeon? I hate the piss dungeon. I hate it. It's so bad. I don't mind healing on it, but I hate tanking on it. Ooh, Samurai is a lot of fun. I've been maining Samurai for Stormblood, then I'll switch to Gunbreaker for Shadowbringers. Ooh. I love that everyone has like a canon class for each X-Pack. Meanwhile, I'm sitting here just playing Dark Knight through everything now. Like I was summoner. Well, I mean, I guess that's like part of Pepper's lore because I was summoner in A Realm Reborn and then I was summoner in Heaven's Ward and then she got really depressed and really sad and started to be a Dark Knight. <laughs> Gunbreaker becomes better when you get double down at 90. So you're telling me I literally have to get like 2 million more XP to actually enjoy Gunbreaker? <laughs> I started learning Dancer for lore reasons. Ooh, okay. What's the lore there? Ask Aaron. Hello. Or ask Aaron. Hi, how are you? 
I was Brad in every expansion? Brad. Oh, Bard! In my head, I'm like, you were Brad Pitt? <laughs> I heard my buddy healing through Orem Vale, and it was hilariously terrible. Yeah, no, Orem Vale, I think, is one of the worst. One of the worst dungeons in the game. <laughs> I'm just Brad. I was Monk for a Realm Reborn, Machinist for Heaven's War, Dancer for Stormblood, and Shadowbringers... And, oh, Dancer for Snowball and Shadowbringers and Reaper for Endwalker. Oh, there was a really big part of me that wanted to play Reaper for Endwalker, remember, guys? But I just, I love, I love Dark Knight too much. I was inspired by your Baldur's Gate character. Did you get character mods? Yeah, I'm using one face mod in Baldur's Gate and one hair mod in Baldur's Gate. That's it. Nothing too, too, too crazy. The class journey is always a fun story for which class? Dark Knight? I made Carlock a barbarian in Baldur's Gate 3. Wait, she could dip into bard? Sick. You know what's funny? I forgot the name of Orem Vale. So I found a, a listicle, a listicle of the worst dungeons in Final Fantasy 14 and it was at number one. See, it's literally the worst. No one likes that dungeon. <coughs> Also, I saw Devin was in here, but I doubt he's still here. But anyways, hi, Devin. I was a summoner through all of it, but with the events of Shatterbringers, she loses her connection to her carbuncle slash arcane powers, so she had to learn another way to fight, and dancing gave her release and filled that empty void of her carby. Oh my god, wait, that's really sweet! Wait, if she lost her connection to her carbuncle, does that mean her carbuncle is, like, gone? I love that. Hi, Orok. What's up? Welcome. I played every expansion as Summoner, but I'll probably do the next as whatever the new caster is. Oh, yeah. When do you think we're going to get more news on what the new roles are going to be? Everyone is saying, like, the next fan fest that we might get, like, one reveal. I hope that's true. I want to learn more. Hi, Storm! Hello and welcome back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday? Wait, this Sunday? Betting the next, the new caster is Pictomancer? What's Pictomancer? Hi, Minho! Hello! It's nice to see you. And what's Geomancer? I don't know any other Final Fantasy like classes, so y'all are gonna have to walk me through this. Be Morpher? Morpher? Like you can morph into things? Also, hi, Counterbreak. What male character would you date from Jujutsu Kaisen? What's the one with the spacers and the long hair? I don't watch JJK. I've like seen, I think, one episode, and it was pretty good, but like that was it. <clears throat> Sunday's live letter for 6.5. Okay, what are the live letters? I don't I don't remember. The live letters, because like I don't read them because I'm not up to date, right? I just get like the recap from friends. Um, but the live letters, like is it a video? Is it a blog post? I don't remember. It's a debuff DOT? Damage over time? Caster for caster draw from an older FF game. Ooh. Ooh. I want to play as a caster that's fun. I was enjoying Red Mage, but like it's just not as it's not as good. I don't know. The only caster I'm like actually having fun as, it doesn't even count as a caster, I guess, but a sage. I actually really enjoy healing on sage. It's fun. What about pop star gunslinger class like Yuna from X2? Y'all are losing me. Y'all are all losing me. Oh, it's a video conference. Oh, okay, okay. <coughs> Sage is like a half DPS healer, right? Yeah, it's like heals meets DPS basically.
one second. Do I get a snack chat? I feel like I should get a snack. I feel like I, I'm in, I deserve a snack right now. I don't have anything in my home. I should have grabbed a snack when I went downstairs. I had a coffee and it made me poop like real bad. But yeah, Sage, you have to, uh, you deal damage to heal. It's so fun. It's honestly so fun. Hi, game she plays. Hello. Sorry, can you do us a small favor? We want to see the view out of your window. I really like tall buildings. Makes me think you're in a light time movie. No, no, you're not doxing me. I'm sorry. That's not happening. Like, who the fuck is we and who is us? No. The most you're getting is this blur. I'm sorry. Thank you for the hydration, Hiker. Didn't get all the poopies out after last night? Oh, I did. I got all the poopies out. I was pooping pretty bad. I had ramen and Popeyes. And my poop. Oh my fucking god. Omo, hello! Hi, hi, hi! I want snacks. Oh god. Should I text my boyfriend and tell him to get me snacks? I doubt he will. <laughs> that dude thought he was slick i know like don't ask people to like see out their window it's really weird it's a very common thing that people do to dox women like let me just let me just like angle my camera this way honestly that would be like when i saw the amandaline cosplayer in their normal clothes too real don't like it <laughs> Don't break the, like, the immersion. Grahatia would get you snacks? Grahatia would get me snacks. Grahatia is the boyfriend that everyone needs. Or even the bestie, you know? By the way, um, I was talking about how obsessed I am with Final Fantasy XIV during vacation. My friend got it with the free trial and also bought it. Fuck yeah! Spreading the good word. Sp doing You're doing the Lord's work, Ava. <laughs> no is this gonna be like a like a new copy pasta or meme in here it's okay josh or not i'll take my shame no you're good just let us roast you a little bit don't ask don't ask ladies to look out their window or whatever can you please just swell for everyone see the 16 digit code on the front of your credit card as well as the security code on the back i'm like i love long numbers I'm just really fascinated by numbers and I want to add them up. <laughs> Horseman would get you a hot chocolate. Horseman would get me a hot chocolate. I cost with Gav at the weekend, on the weekend, and Ben rushed over to get a selfie. Please tell me you're going to post a picture in the Discord server because I need to see this. What about your poop? Is it healthy? Don't tell us your shit don't. Don't tell us your shit don't. I mean, my poops are healthy. Why would you put, or why you put disabled in your tags? Because I'm disabled. Cause I have it. Cause I have a disability. <laughs> why else would I, Why else would I put that in my tags? We got no spoilers. English, queer, woman of color, disabled. <laughs> Come on, you got this. I believe in you, chat. Don't fail me. Come on. Oh my God, your Gav is so fucking good. You look amazing. You look amazing. So, yeah, I'm English. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot to let you all know that I actually am English. Yeah, you're right. <coughs> you're right. Yeah. Wait, re wait, what? Really? I'm sorry. I'm new here. You're all right. It's okay to be new. Don't worry. It's just, yeah. The reason why disabled is in my tags is because I'm bloody disabled. That would make the most sense, right? <laughs> 
Sire, can you please do us a small favor? We want us to view from your FC house. I like warts floating above the abyss. Makes me feel like I'm in a fantasy novel. Yo, someone jump on the roof real quick. Let's get that POV. Oh shit. Save life fell. There. Can y'all hear me good? Can you just turn the camera towards Gengar's gussy? Hold on. Can I like even get you a good shot of the gussy? The Gen gussy? Oh my god, do you see it? Oh my god, do you see the hole? There it is. <laughs> oh. I'm like way too zoomed in. Ah, <sighs> all right. Is it time? Do we begin? Oh my god, I'm scared. Chad, I'm scared. <coughs> all right. I think we're, I think, oh god, I think we're gonna start it. I think we're gonna, we're gonna, oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Chat, are we ready? Is it happening? Are we good? Are we ready? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I feel like crying. I, I haven't played this game in so long, and like, it's my like, it's my main game, and I've been getting, like, my imposter syndrome, guys, is like really bad. I have not been feeling like really good about like work and streaming and just like all of that shit so like <laughs> it's just been it's just been rough it's just been so fucking rough and uh yeah i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited that's it i'm just really excited We're gonna have to do like a lore recap though. I'm gonna be asking y'all a lot of questions, okay? We're gonna, you're gonna have to be giving me a lot of hot chocolate tonight. Hi, Perfect Calm. Yeah, life has been throwing hands. I feel like I just can't catch a break. <gasps> Bye, Ava! Take care, enjoy your din din. If we cry before playing the game, does it really count? <laughs> it doesn't count, but chat will tell you otherwise. <coughs> Okay. Put it on the board. All right, hold on. Let me just like, oh God. Let me adjust. Let me adjust. I gotta adjust. I gotta adjust these fucking ears. Yo. <gasps> Hello? Am I getting a million gill in game? Bro, I'll fucking take it here. Take these eggs, bro. Thank you. Thank you, dentist. Thank you for the hug, David. I appreciate it. Thank you. My phone literally just like will not charge. Ah. Cusco ears? How dare you call me a llama? How dare you call me a llama? A llama? He's supposed to be dead! Which is actually going to be me. Oh my god, I cannot pin my hair. Can I like... Can I pin this properly? There we go. Okay. I may have to do like another one. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. All right. Let's change the game to Final Fantasy 14. Oh my god. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. How's the audio? Is the audio okay? Is it a little too loud? I feel like I might have to make some adjustments here. Is that good? Or is this too loud? Oh, I'm so hungry now. I have like the anxiety hunkies. <laughs> I have no snacks. I have nothing. I don't want to order more food. It's a bit loud now. Okay, how about this? Is this good? <clears throat> I watched Holes last night, and every time Madame Zeroni spoke, I just heard, pull the lever, crunk. Oh my god, Holes. What a classic. Alright, we good? 
Attack a dummy? Alright, dentist, come here. Is the audio audioing? Are we good? Is it too loud? I'm gonna try talking while I do this. Well, let me know. You just couldn't call a movie Holes these days. I mean, look, if we can have a movie called Bottoms, we can have a movie called Hole. A little loud? How about now? Is it still like really loud? Better? Better or is it good? Better or good? <laughs> Guess I finally ended up as the blood sacrifice. It's about time. It was gonna happen eventually, you know? All good on my end? Alrighty. Okay, okay. Sounds good. Nice. Ah! Alright, okay. Hello, friends. Oh, I miss saying hi to everybody. Look at Vosk and their fucking fishnets. Vosk always looks like a hoe, and honestly, I respect it. I respect it. All right. Okay. Okay. You ready? I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna go now. I'm scared. I'm fucking scared. Am I gonna be okay? This is, I'm not gonna be okay. I'm gonna cry. This is gonna be rough. Okay. Oh, God. And my armor. Oh, my Dark Knight armor. Oh, Pepper, you're so cute. Pepper, you look so good. Oh, oh my God. Wait, do I role play it up? Do I wear like winter gear? Is that the mood? Do I do it? Do I wear something like cozy? Do I even have anything cozy? I do. I have this. Man, I don't want to wear that. All right. Okay. All right. It's happening. It's happening. Okay. So we're going back to Ilsa Bard. All right. Oh, my God. I thought we were on the... Oh my god, chat. I thought we were on level 83 quest. We are still on level 82. Holy shit. I I literally have made like no progress in the MSQ. I've made zero progression. I thought I was further in than I actually was. This is so embarrassing. This is so embarrassing. <clears throat> Maybe we put this off until tomorrow? Wait, put what off until tomorrow? What are we putting off? The MSQ? Nah, Bessie, we're not putting this off anymore. We're going balls to the wall. Oi. Oh, Minho, hello! What are you giving me? Are you also gonna give me some 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 money, some gill? <gasps> I get a puppy. I get chewy. Man, I was scared I was gonna get hot chocolate. Honestly, I really thought you were gonna give me hot chocolate for a second here. Let me like make this smaller. I don't need it to be that big. But I, on the other hand, will give you hot chocolate. Thank you for the puppy. Thank you for the pup. I'll send you a little request. <coughs> BRB, gonna grab coffee. Do not poop. <laughs> None of that nonsense. I waited 84 years for progress. <laughs> oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, so we gotta go speak with Alfie now. Oh my god. Ah, I have not done this in so long. Oh my god, the tism is tisming. <laughs> The tism is tisming. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. All right. What's up, Alfino? How you doing, bestie? In spite of the obstacles we faced, our plans proceed apace. Just a little far farther, and we will reach the capital itself. Sounds good. Time wave less than three. Jacko, hello for this. Oh, hello for the six month. Thank you for the six month resub. Hello, hello. Alfino and Alize frozen to statues long ago. Oh my god, they've been waiting here for so long. I feel so bad, my poor babies. Still, we mustn't get ahead of ourselves. As soon as the camp has been made fit for purpose, we are to discuss a course of action with Lucia. Would you mind asking Stola and Graha to join us in that building to the northeast of the camp? Alize and I will meet you there. Of course. I miss my cat wife and husband. Or technically my cat wives. Graha Tia is my wife! 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, let me adjust my journal like real quick as well. Let me make this smaller. Everything is so gosh darn big. All right, we're just, is that Larry? Do I see a Larry behind me? Is, wait, is Larry a Lollafell again? <laughs> Oh my god! Wait, Larry, Larry, are you a woman? Yo, slay! You want uppies? Oh my god, Larry, you want uppies? Hello, Larry. I can't give you uppies, but I can give you huggies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> I get head pats. Thank you for the head pats. I get kiss. Mwah. Ah, all the dotes to go around. Nothing but dotes. I have so much. I have so many dotes to give. <laughs> If you give me head pads, you get a kiss. That's how this works. It's that easy. It's that simple. Oh my God, look at your mount. Look at this gator. It's so fucking cute. Oh my God, Do, are we all just hopping on the, hopping on the animals? Larry, if you're saying goodbye to me, then goodbye, my sweet child. It was nice seeing ya. I gotta find, I gotta find my wife. There she is. All right. Farewell. Hello, wife. Hey! A meeting? Yes, I'll make my way over once my head is cleared. <coughs> In truth, I've been feeling out of sorts since we arrived. The air is thick with a palpable aura of malevolence. Tis the monstrous tower on the horizon, jagged, hideous, and holy. Even at this distance, its presence is overwhelming. Much like the sensation I felt in the Tower of Zot, only far more terrifying. The ether flows unceasingly towards it, converging into a swirling mass of unfathomable power. For a blessing, the constant chill in the air is helping to anchor my senses in the here and now. Tell the others I shall be with you in a few moments. All right, Mumsy. Do I have to go find Grahatia now? Here, let me adjust my HUD. I want this to be smaller too. Everything is just like really big. And because the UI, like the quality has dropped, I need to like <laughs> make sure it's not hurting my head. All righty. All right, where's Grahatia? Where's my wife? Where is he? He's over here. I see him in his little coat. You know what? I feel left out. I do have to wear a coat. I have to wear this coat. I don't have a choice. Or what if I wear the slutty coat? Do I wear the slutty winter fit? Nah, we're gonna wear this one. <coughs> I'm on curl now. I know I saw, or Coral. I don't remember how to pronounce it. I heard it in FF16 the other day. I know, I saw when I saw your, um, your thingamabop. I saw that you left. Game, you have to go to a cool place. Me, Graha will need extra snuggles for warm. Honestly, you have the right priorities. Oh my god! Hello! You'll be pleased to know most of the tempered here. The tempered have been quartered inside the nearby buildings and are receiving treatment as we speak. I do, however, feel no small amount of guilt for com commandeering civilian homes. The opulence may be long gone, but everything is exactly as they left it. Considering the length of time that has clearly passed since, one would expect to find them ransacked. Strangely, there are no signs of anything having been stolen. It's possible that everyone fled at the first sign of trouble, though it seems to me they left far too many useful possessions behind. I, although there's no conclusive evidence, I strongly suspect they were tempered. Sorry, I was merely thinking aloud. You mentioned a meeting? I'll make my way there. Eee! All right, sounds good. Man, I forgot about the tempering. I forgot that that was like, that was a thing, and people were being like controlled, basically. Graha has the slutty coat. Honestly, it's a pretty fucking fire coat. I do like the coat that Graha is wearing. I wish I could make like a cute glam out of it, but I prefer when Pepper is wearing like something collared or has like a turtleneck okay, going. <gasps> Only filthy! Thank you for the hundred biddies. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Coffee achieved. What I miss. We are about to have a meeting with Alfino, Alize, Ishtola, and Graha. Oh my god, and Lise is here, and Sabrina. Oh my god, I forgot. I forgot about everybody. I'm getting emotional. Game said we need catboy collarbones. You know what? And I support it. Thank you for informing the others of our meeting. When everyone is here, we will begin. <gasps> oh my god, it's a cutscene. <coughs> Oh my god. Our present situation is as follows. <laughs> Efforts to aid the people of Garlemald have begun in earnest. 
Moreover, having entered into the capital, the Imperial Palace is within our reach. Slow. But before we proceed further, we must learn what has befallen this city. For therein lies the key to understanding and combating the Talofaroi's designs. I have a suggestion, if I may. I mean, he would know Several better than most of us, right? Several of the Imperial soldiers we captured in the Magna <coughs> Glacies are members of the Popularis and acquaintances of mine. Glacius? That's how you pronounce that? Glacius? They should be able to give a reliable account of the events leading to the capital's downfall. A promising idea. I will assist the healers and their ministrations. Of course, I will require a porxy of my own, assuming you can spare one. Would you like a hand? No, no, I am sure we will manage. Better that you take my place in the field. The noxious ether of this place disagrees with me, and as I shall need to draw on my own for the treatment, it will be prudent for me to remain within the camp. I still can't believe, like, proxies. This talk of curing the, the tempered is all well and are good. Are what they, yeah, are I what they use the for the tempered. Is a pressing concern. That was such a funny reveal in the story. All the houses around bringers. here are fitted with ceruleum eaters that could keep us warm and toasty. Problem is, the machines seem to have given up the ghost, and if we keep sitting around, freezing our asses off, we'll be next. My smiths reckon that with <laughs> the right parts, they can have them working again, but it won't be easy. Estonian brooding in the corner. The machinists will assist them in the repairs. The rest of us should either stand watch or survey the area. Why does he look so hot in winter armor? We've made our presence known to the Telofroi. They will be searching for us, if they have not already ascertained our position. I am looking. That we have seen no sign of them since the battle suggests they have yet to do so. However, I suspect they may be biding their time. Or perhaps we are beneath their notice. In any event, we'll find no answers standing around here. Uriange, Estinian, and myself have visited Garlemald recently, so we'll lead the reconnaissance efforts. Perhaps bolstered by a few Bosnian and Dalmaskian scouts from my previous excursion for good measure. Don't forget about us Alamegans. We have experienced scouts of our own. Well now. This is turning out to be a rather sizable team. With such numbers, we should be able to cover a wide area with relative ease, including that surrounding the Imperial Palace. How about you, Graha? I have a feeling we'll find a use or two for that vanishing spell of yours. As long as it doesn't knock him the fuck out again. <laughs> <laughs> Twould be my honor to be of service, though I doubt that you of all people need rely on my tricks. That leaves us with guard duty. As a matter of fact, <laughs> I have something else in mind for the two of you and Alphano. <laughs> the two of you and Alphano, <laughs> not just the three of us. In the center of the capital lies the Eblen Rhine. I would Eblen have you Rhine. search the area for survivors. Your keen sense of direction, honed in your extensive travels, should prove useful in navigating the ice fields. If there are any survivors, we'll surely find them. Extensive travels is something of an understatement, but I suppose if there's nothing else that needs doing... Ice fields? I love ice fields! Oh wait, no I don't. <laughs> As ever, you do not want for enthusiasm. But given your experience traipsing about through Curthus, I should be surprised if you let a little inclement weather dampen your redoubtable spirits. And even if that were the case, the promise of hot soup upon your return would surely spur you to action. You all have your duties. Let us make haste. May the fury bless and keep you. Hearing may the fury bless you warms my heart. I feel like Orshi's with me. 
<laughs> Wait, bunny ears? Zeppla? Um, nope. These are Miko ears. These are Miko ears. Also, it's nice to see you, Sunrise. <coughs> now my throw is back to not working. I hope you appreciate my sacrifice. Honestly, I do. Thank you, dentist. She had me at soup? Honestly, like, if someone offers me warm soup, who am I to say no? I fucking love soup. I love soup. Actually, I could fuck up some soup right now. Okay, let me adjust my, my chat again. There we go. I gotta put you all a little bit higher there. Like, ain't no one getting me snacks. Nobody is getting me snacks tonight. I'm going to be snackless. Oh my God, we're going to have to rely on good old Uber Eats chat. Not now though, not now. Emmy, hello, nice to see you. I know soup season is on the way. You're so beautiful and appreciate your humor. Thank you. Hi, Simona. It's, it's pronounced Simona, right? Hello, I miss Pepper so much. I did too. I missed Pepper so fucking much. I missed best girl. I really did. Oh. Did you remove me as a friend? I just added you. Oh, no. I, th <laughs> I thought you removed me because I couldn't see your username. I was like, I literally just added you and you've already gotten rid of me. <laughs> oh, my God. Could you imagine? Like, damn. Damn. Didn't realize y'all didn't like me like that. Oh, my God. A mandolin. Ah! I'm seeing double. I'm seeing du I'm seeing double. Wait, I'm seeing <laughs> I'm seeing double. Hi, Mandolin here. Let me give you head pets. Oh wait, can I even can I even type pet? I give pets. <laughs> Let me talk to my sweet boy though. There's this odd perception that Ishgardians have lived the whole lives in the snow, but it really wasn't that bad before the calamity. And afterwards, well, I was really more than a few paces from a raging fire. This dreadful place, on the other hand, is nothing but cold, cold, cold. And it's my understanding that Ilsebad has always been this way. Gods, can you imagine? Oh, princess. Oh, sweet, sweet princess. Who else can I talk to? Oh, Alberic? Isn't he, like, the other, like, Dragoon dude? Wait a fucking second. Yo! <coughs> Several of the Temple Knights are off on reconnaissance at present. We Ishgardians have seen our fair share of frost in the past years, so we are more than ready for this icy bout. The Rothgar from Bosia, on the other hand, are having a devil of a time adjusting to these chilly climes. The warming stones we lent them seem to have helped, though. The warming stones? What do you what do you do with a warming stone? I have like warming like items that I like electronic like warming devices that I put in my pocket. You know? I put it in my pocket and like I and like I I turn it on and then I hold it and it keeps my hand warm. Is that what they mean? Like, do they have like that same kind of thing in this game? I oh, know I'll have soup in the summer. I'll have it in the winter. I'll have it in fall and I'll have it in spring. Soup is a year round dish. Oh my God, wait, we have two chewies. Wait, what if I brought out my chewy? That means I have to get rid of, of Orshi, but I, I will for a second. For a split moment, I'll get rid of him. And then I'm bringing him right back. Where's my Chewy? Oh no, wait, that's not Chewy. Chewy's this one. <laughs> it's the other sheep. Look at them. Look at them all. Look at these little good boys. Look at these sweet good boys. They're so happy. Look at their eyebrows. Come after me. Look at him go. Look at him go. I want a white one. <clears throat> I want a white one so it matches Waldo. Could you imagine if I had like a little Waldo running around with me? I have the salt and pepper seal, which is like, you know, <laughs> which kind of works. And I have, uh, there's another one I have. Where is it? It was uh, this thing, the silky, which like doesn't really make sense, but it's a white fluffy thing that floats, you know? I guess I'll be paying for snacks again as you fucking should. As you should, it is your right. <laughs> Hope you're doing fine. I'm doing my best. I'm doing the best that I can. The best that I can with the resources given to me. Wait. <gasps> why? Why is your cheer on white and yours blue? Wait, what color is mine? 
<gasps> Mine is blue! Minnow, why is yours white? Wait, that's so pretty! You got the cum glow sticks! Oh, they added another cheer? Oh, how do I get that one? How do I get that one? Do I have to pay for that one too? Oh, there's a purple one! Oh, I need that. I need it. It's on the store? Fuck. Okay. Okay, it's not limited time, right? Can I get it whenever? I may have to disappear for like 30 minutes, hopefully less. At some point, gotta bite to my friends if it's something she can drop it off for me. That's okay, Kelsey. Just make sure we have a mod present, please. Is this store with the FanFest people got them free? Fucking FanFestians. Goddamn FanFestians. But okay, good. That means I can get it another time. I don't have to get it right now. Wait, the boyfriend got back to me. He's gonna get me snacks. Yes! Yes! Putting that man to use. Putting him to work. <laughs> Why are we crying? Because we're playing and Walker in Final Fantasy 14 makes me cry a bunch. Because I tried to get tickets twice, to get the tickets twice, I got blue ball. No! Well, that's why Emmy's crying. Minho? <laughs> Minho, you good? Wait, I went to FanFest. How do I get them? I don't. Is it like in your email? Do you have to link your account? Hi, James! Yes, it's a peppermint. Peppermint is back. Peppermint is back and she's here to cry. Hey, always great when the boyfriend brings snacks. Snacks bringing a snack, if you will. True. Except he's not bringing them. He's gonna be just fucking ordering them for me. But you know what? I'll take it. It's a dub. It's still a dub in my eyes. You know? <laughs> All right. All right. Oh my God, Amandalane, you're so slutty. Are you not cold, babes? All right, okay. Let me speak with Alfino now. He's pondering. I've never thought myself much of an explorer, though I suppose my adventures have taken me to all sorts of strange and distant places. That in mind, traversing an ice field should be a simple feat. Hi, baby girl. Gods be good. Hey, oh. hey, no music, bestie. Banger though. Do 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 do. Meow 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 meow. Fuck. What is it? What is it called again? What's it called? How do I mute that again? Is it? No, it's not BGM. It's um, it's something else. Fuck. It's something else. Oh, off. oh. Performance off does not exist unless I spelt it wrong. It it uh, it does not exist. <laughs> I must say in this house we stand pepper. I must leave by now, so I wish you the best MX2 experience. No, I'll miss you! But yes, we stand pepper in this household and only pepper. <clears throat> Gods be good, if it's this cold with Tari's clothing, I dread to think how we'd fare without it. I must have moved to thank him when we when next we meet. Performance zero. Right, maybe that's it. Nope. <clears throat> Gods wait, I already read that. Fuck. Thank you for that gift and something and something else. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are you presently? Makes me realize too that while the people of Garlemald have spent their whole lives in conditions like these, even they'd be hard pressed to survive away from the warmth of the homes. If there are any survivors, we must find them and quickly. <gasps> Wait, let me decline that so I can accept it as a gunbreaker and get experience. I'm so smart. Right, where's my gun breaker? Thank you, bestie. All right, complete. Wait, in case it puts me in a cutscene, let me also just change my clothes. 
<laughs> All right, there we go. All right, complete. It didn't put me in a cutscene, but that's okay. <laughs> Wait, now I have to speak to a mandolin? Wait, is a mandolin coming with us? Oh my god! Do I get to do my quest with a mandolin? Ah! Okay, oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so fucking excited. <laughs> Tracks in the snow. A mandolin is, as usual, milling about aimlessly. Yo, me too. Me too, bestie. What ho, chums? Been given something to do, have you? As it happens, I too have been ordered to make myself useful. Sounds like a rather sounds like rather a tall order. <clears throat> Since you ask, we're to scour the Al Eblin rhyme for survivors. What? Wander around the ice fields on the off chance you'll find someone. It'd take forever to finish the job without the benefit of my expertise, or more specifically, my telescope. Bestie, why are you carrying a telescope on you? Come, friends. I know just the spot to begin our search. Oh, all right, my sweet boy. I'll probably regret this, but we may as well humor him. Yeah, we don't really have much of a choice, right? All right, where are we going? We're going this way? All right, we're going to RP run. <laughs> just got here from work. I hope you had a good work day presently. David, thank you for the head pats. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, this music. <gasps> Wait, there's a star on the map. Oh, is this building a star? Does this tower, like, it's a star or like a snowflake. Look! Or I guess like a cog wheel. It's cute! Okay, back to the uh, task at hand. Let's go, let's go. You found it. It's perform perform sounds. Okay. Well, I already turned it off. But thank you. I'll, I'll remember your that. Walking? You better go catch it. Oh ha ha! Thank you, Teddy, for the ten month resub. How you doing? Hello, hello. I gotta fix my cat ears. They're not on correctly. Ah, ah. Oh, this music is so good. Are you kidding? Oh, it's so moody. I've been awake for less than five minutes, and the first thing you did was sub to me? You're an icon. Well, it's a good thing I'll be live for the next, like, four or five hours. You're in good hands. <clears throat> Alright, let's speak with the twins. The few, building, like, the few buildings I can see don't appear to be residences. Residencies, I guess. They may still warrant investigation, though. I'm surprised by how many wild beasts there are roaming about the place. That was now the soldiers have gone. They're free to wander and forage as they please. Oh my god, he literally has a telescope. A mandolin literally... Oh, I love him. I love my brother-in-law. Oh, cutscene. Not the mischievous music. I spy with my little telescope. A massive sheep thing. Or maybe it's a cow. Not what we're after either way. Is that an ether current? Ah, no. Just the wind sprite. Hmm. Other than that, it's all snow, snow, snow. But lo! What do I see over yon hillock? Where were... There's no mistaking it. That's a girl! <laughs> Alright, but is she in trouble? A survivor! Show me! Over there, behind that tree. It looks like she's running away from something. Though surely not us. She wouldn't even know we're here unless she had a telescope like mine. All I can tell is that she's wearing a pale green dress. A rather fetching one at that. Come on, Amanda Lane. Is that a pale green dress? I don't think I know anybody with a pale green dress. She'd be long gone by the time we get anywhere near. But we should be able to follow her footprints. Bro, I have a mount I can use. I can catch up easily. <clears throat> I'll let Lucia know where where you're headed. Oh, and take these warming tinctures with you. Oh, <gasps> thank you. The poor girl must be chilled to the bone, if not on the verge of freezing to death. That's actually very thoughtful. Thank you. But would you need some for yourself? No, no, I'll be fine. As a man of chivalry, my honor demands I do no less. Unless we forget, the very reason we are here is to, pro is to protect those in need. Now go, and Godspeed. Oh, man, Elaine. If it wasn't a girl, would you be this chivalrous? Probably not. <laughs> I love him. I do love a Manolene. He's got a heart of gold, that one. 
Why are you still here? If you dally any longer, you'll miss your chance to play the hero. Isn't that what you would like to do, though? All right, okay, let's go find this girl. Let's see. Oh, I see the little, the little sparkles in the distance. I have to ask, have you ever somehow been sleeping and have been a avoiding leg cramps a game? I don't know what you're asking me. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. I tried to get into the story of this game, but I'm not a story player. See, I'm a story player. I love a good narrative experience. And this game gives me the perfect combination of compelling gameplay and compelling narrative. It is the perfect game. Hey, to defend his honor, gestures to everything he did for Anawa. Okay, you know what? You got me there. No, I love him, Annalyn. He means well, okay? He means nothing but the best. Wait, hold on. Hold on. The boyfriend is asking me what I want. What do I want? Wait, am I getting attacked? Ah! I'm getting attacked! Okay, wait. I got this. Oh, I used the wrong ability. Man, okay. No, oh, wrong ability as well. Wrong ability as well. Why am I turning you around? I don't have to turn you around. Oh, but well, you'll be dead in a second. You'll be dead in a second. Oh, that is big. That is big. Nice. The sheep thing we saw indeed. Hi, Garcia. What's up? Wait, you're three cry counts away from a rather nice milestone. I know. Let's see if we can get a single cry this stream. Okay, let me figure out what do I want? What do I want to eat, chat? What even? Like, what am I eating? I like, I low key want pizza, but like, I shouldn't have pizza at this hour. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I feel like I'm getting sick again, too. My throat just does not feel good. And I know I'm like just recovering from being sick, but damn. Do I get a pizza? Chat, what do I get? What do I want? What do I what do I eat? What do I put in my stomach? Crow just walked up and had beef with you? I know the cows don't like me. The cows and sheepos don't like me. Like I was sleeping and felt the slow buildup of my leg cramping, slash having a Charlie horse and was aware of it and to make it into a game to see if I can delay or stop the cramp. Oh, okay, no, like I've never, I never wake up with a cramp or I never wake up from a cramp. I'll wake up and then get a cramp. Ooh, chicken quesadilla, curry. I've been craving pizza. If you've been craving pizza and I eat pizza in front of you, will you be upset? Will that make you sad? <laughs> Would that be mean of me to do chat? To just rub it in your face? Do you still want soup? Honestly? Yes and no. I could fuck up some soup, but I don't know if soup is the vibe. I'm feeling like really sick though. Let's see. <coughs> hmm. Yo, buy one, get one free. Oh, but it's nothing good. Hmm. Do I get dumplings? Oh, chicken noodle soup. It would be mean and completely like you to get pizza to bully us. I had five guys earlier and had to take a nap. I know. Usually after I have one guy, I have to take a nap. It could be a lot. Bold of you to take five at once. Oh, poutine. Mmm. Mmm. Routine would be good. Just doing my civic duty. Gotta do what you gotta do. True, McDonald's isn't a bad option, but it would make me shit bricks. Maybe I should get soup. It's yeah, soup season is soup season is like rapidly approaching. Maybe that's the that's the play. No, I don't want soup though. What do I want? I feel like I should just get pizza then. I think I'm just gonna get pizza. I 
I gotta figure this out now before my boyfriend gets too drunk and doesn't doesn't get me what I want. <laughs> <coughs> Quick, favorite pizza toppings: onions, jalapenos, pineapples, and pepperoni. That's usually my go-to. Sumi, hello! Yes, we are back. We are so fucking back, baby. We are so back. Oh, did have you met Hayden? Hayden who? Hayden Christensen? Yes. No way she said pineapple. Hey, yo, do we got pineapple haters in the chat? The audacity! It's nice to see Sire back on Endwalker. I know, right? It feels so right. Was Hayden super nice? He was. He was very nice. He was very sweet. If I get pizza, will it make me feel sick, chat? Mm. Ooh, okay, we're gonna do spinach, red onions, pine, no, we're not gonna do pineapple, actually. Red onions, banana pepper, no, no, no banana peppers. Pepperoni. Green peppers. Gangsters, what's, what's up, up guys? guys? You may be about to get attacked in game again. So far, so good. So far, we're actually chilling. The sheep did not attack me. At least not yet. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred biddies. Let's see. Let's see. And we're going to get barbecue dip. I think that's going to be the vibe. I think that's going to be the vibe. I think that's the vibe. You were straight up about to say banana. No, no, no. Banana peppers. Hot banana peppers are so fucking good. I was right by the way. My body rebelled from yesterday's dairy at the end of my shift. See? And chat, this is why you shouldn't let Kelsey eat dairy. Do not let Kelsey consume dairy. I'm only looking out for her and you just want her to shit. Y'all just want her to die. Yeah, Derry got hands. And yes, pineapple does belong on pizza. Chat, what's your go-to? What is your go-to for pizza? What is, what are your go-to toppings? Pepperoni, mushrooms, black olives, onions, anchovies on cracker crust? Anchovies? Nah. Miss me with that. Miss me with that. <clears throat> Do you want to be a girl that poops or a bitch that shits? <laughs> Look, I'm a girl that poops sometimes, but clearly Kelsey is a bitch that shits. Anchovies over pineapple zigs, you are nuts. No way. Okay, I cannot put mushrooms on pizza. You know why? Because for me, chat don't get mad at me i've said this before but i'm sure some of you haven't heard this please don't get mad but mushrooms taste like sweaty balls mushrooms if they're not done properly just taste like sweaty balls and anytime i have mushrooms i'm like damn sweaty balls and anytime i have sweaty balls i'm like damn mushrooms you know like it's just not a good time for me Korean or Vietnamese fish sauce? Oh, I know what fish sauce is and like oyster sauce and I fuck with that. But like actual anchovies on a pizza? No, thank you. Goat cheese, caramelized onions, preserved lemons, balsamic and prosciutto. Wait, chowder? That actually sounds fire. Also, hi. 
Pepperoni and green pepper, mushrooms, olives, and chives. Ooh, chives. Okay. You got me there. You got me there, Keith. Pepperoni, bacon, and sausage. Stuffed crust. Okay, so you like meat. Meat lover in the house. Pineapple with pepperoni. Based, Jacko. Based. Ham, red onions. It used to be bell peppers, but they're trying to kill me. Why are bell peppers trying to kill you? What if I like sweaty balls? Hey, look, there's nothing wrong with sweaty balls. I like a little bit of flavor. I'm just saying, I can't have mushrooms without thinking about sweaty balls. <coughs> you know, I get why you say that. Oh, they gotta be deeply marinated for me. Yeah, <laughs> the mushrooms, not the balls. Wait, y'all don't marinate your balls? The sweat marinates the balls, if you know what I mean. Why is this a conversation I'm having? <laughs> but like, am I wrong though? Am I wrong? Tell me I'm wrong, chat. Deny it. I'm marinating right now, yo. Same, bro. That swamp ass bot to be crazy. That swamp ass bot to be nuts. Yo, does Larry want to fuck up this sheep with me? Does the little pumpkin boy want to fuck up this sheep with me? Yo, let's go. Let's fuck it up. Let's go, bestie. Did that not go off? Hello? Slay Larry! Yes! Look at us. Oh, we're so good. <laughs> Taps watch MSQ. Look, we're gonna get back to the MSQ. Don't worry. Here's a good one. Ooh, figs. Figs, red onion, balsamic vinegar, reduction, and fresh mozzarella on a brushed olive oil crust, then wood fired. Okay, that sounds fucking sexy. Fig and arugula pizza actually fucks. That shit is so good. Shout out to Little Italy. Shout out to Hayden Christensen. Like, honestly, if it weren't for Little Italy, I probably would never have tried fig and arugula pizza. And it's actually delectable. It's so fucking good. This is what the boxer briefs are for. The boys gotta breathe. Oh my god. Have y'all seen the meme on Twitter of, um... Fuck, let me, okay, no, I have to find it. There's this meme that I found that honestly made me cry of laughter because it reminded me of my boyfriend. And when I showed it to him, he also died and I will get into it the second I, I show y'all the meme. It's so funny. Wait, did I show him in real life or did I text it to him? Hold on, let me see if I can find it in my phone. Oh my god, please tell me I can find it. Yes! Okay, this meme is so good. This meme is so, so good. Ready? Every time a man wears these, you know the dick toxic. Toxic, but you know you limp it into that Uber home. This meme had me in tears. And my boyfriend starts dying, and he's like, babe, look! And he... Like, <laughs> and he shows me and he's like, look what I'm wearing. I'm like, yeah, babe, I know. That's why it's funny. <laughs> you literally wear those. <laughs> why would they say something so bold and controversial yet so right? It's literally the truest tweet I've ever seen. And it actually destroys me. Those are the black air forces of boxers. Man, my grandpa used to wear those all the time. How's your grandma looking? Red's my favorite color. <laughs> sweaty balls just in time for the holidays. Ah, yes, yeah, sweaty balls. My favorite Christmas treat. <laughs> Yo, Babuji! Hello, hello! How are ya? You've seen your grandpa's boxers? Wait. That's actually a better follow-up. Why do you know what boxers your grandpa wears? <laughs> it reminded me of a tweet and it was like, guys do not use the pee hole in the boxer brief or not. Oh wait, do you use the pee hole in the boxer brief or not? Wait, there's a pee hole? 
Oh, you mean the little, like, the little guy? The little, the little hole? Do you pee through that? Y'all pissing through that? Crazy. Yo, Dr. Junior, hello. In theory, someone could. What's it for? Wait, the design is literally for peeing? It, it feels like, it feels like a bib for sex. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, I don't want to get all messy. May as well whip out the pussy bib. <laughs> I'm good, Dr. Junior. I'm good. Oh, just for airflow. Yo, I wish women had that. I'm up here wearing like tight ass fucking... Look, okay, let's no, let's talk about this. Because women have underwear that give us literally infections, okay? Our our thongs, our panties, like they're not good. They make us sweat and they just hold on to everything in there. I want pussy ventilators. That's crazy. Why does everything cater towards men? Like, it actually blows. Because when I'm out and I'm wearing my tight denim or whatever the hell, I want my pussy to breathe because the patriarchy, the patriarchy, literally. Thongs are literally nothing. They are the most uncomfortable things I've ever had. If I'm wearing a thong, no, I'm not. Like, dude, my thongs just get consumed by my pussy, okay? Like, women's... Listen, underwear for women is not safe for women with fat pussies, okay? Like, I literally have to wear briefs, all right? I need a vent down there. I need something down there to help my girl breathe, I'm gonna just start stealing my man's toxic undies. Fix one lip. Literally. Literally. I'm out here like, like fucking like this. You know? Got that shit fucking ooeying and gooeying everywhere. <coughs> Welcome, Captain. I'm glad this is your first time here. I'm glad this is what you walk in on. OMG and Walker, yes, good luck at fun. Hello! Yes, it's Endwalker time, but we're having a quick, um, a quick debrief about um, how women's underwear need ventilation. Nixie, how do you feel about about that? What are, what are um, <laughs> debrief indeed? Yeah, you like my pun? You like my pun? It was intentional. <laughs> As one does, yes, indeed. How do you feel about women's underwear? Do you think that we need vents? We were talking about how, like, you know, <clears throat> sweat marinates balls, and we love a little bit of marinating. Marinating? Mar marination? I don't, I don't mind if the balls are marinating, but I don't want my pussy to marinate 24-7. You know? I need some airflow. <laughs> Today I learned Cyberwatt's panties with a screen door. Could you, could you imagine? Could you imagine? It's like, oh, here are my undies. Wait, if you want to actually see the goods, you have to unlock the door. You know? Wait, did I just get a head pat? Wait. Did someone just give me a head pat and leave? Wait, where'd they, where'd they go? Where's my head? Oh, hello! Hello, I give you a kiss. Thank you for the head pats. I appreciate it. Wait, come back. Give me more. Give me more. I want more head pats. Thank you. Larry, are you bringing a sheet? My Larry? 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 This is why your father and I abandoned you. Oh, it's gone. Oh, you failed. <laughs> Y'all want vents and pockets? We are beginning to design this to become rich. Thank you. A pussy pocket vent. Oh my God. We're taking pocket pussy to a whole new level. Sarah presented her theory on the fly in men's briefs being a, po a pussy bib for clean sex. Dude, and no one questioned it. None of y'all even like process that I said that men's briefs are bibs for the vagina. <laughs> and y'all just skipped it. 
Hey, Miss Mint, I hope you're doing well. Hello, I am doing splendid. Happy to be traipsing about in the cold. I hope I said that correctly. Ah ha 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 ha. <laughs> I did, you missed my chat, oh did I? I also wore the four temps coat, the four tom coat for this area, honestly. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real with you. I thought you were talking about briefs again. I thought you were saying that you were the four tom coat as like your brief and honestly, I miss Orshifan a ton so maybe that'd be a good idea for me. Maybe when I miss Orshifan, that's what I should do. <laughs> Nimurook, hello, hello, how you doing? Welcome. <coughs> It's no more let her cook, it's time to let her breathe. Yes! <laughs> I'd come give you a head pat, but we're beating up an old twink for his dragon. I think I'm a little bit more important than a twink. But like, all right, whatever. Whatever, Emmy. <laughs> so it's kind of fucked either way because too much air is bad because it injures new bacteria, which causes infection, but also not enough air also causes infection. I know, we can't win. The pussies just can't win. I want the pussies to get one fucking dub, all right? Is that too much to ask for? Is that truly too much to ask for, chat? Also, chat. <clears throat> Real quick. I am in... I'm hunting for at least one or two more mods for the Final Fantasy XIV streams. We are severely understaffed because all we have is Kelsey. So if anyone would like to, you know, help out with modding, give us a little, a little yeehaw, hello, whoop de doo in the Discord server. I'd love to send you a message. Yeah, salute to Kelsey. Salute to Kelsey. She, she's, she's a god. She's holding the fort down. I don't know how she does it. I don't know how she fucking does it. Mods are so strong and brave. I know. Kelsey truly is the bravest. Love her. But she needs help. I did just get a message deleted in the stream, so maybe not. <laughs> it's because you were trying to delay Endwalker, though, right? <laughs> With no ventilation at that. I know. Kelsey got no ventilation, and she fucking chucking. Oh, hey, I was just watching Nixie play. BG3. Oh, she playing Baldurusi? Yo, Nixie, who are you romancing? What is the tea? What are you doing? I want to know the goods. I need to get ready for a big event tomorrow so I could really use an extra hand tonight. I know Jay is busy until later and I know Red would normally be here. I don't know if Ray is available because Ray is a mod as well. Let's see, let me DM him. Yeah, Nissan is with friends. Everyone is busy. That's okay, though. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Syra can be understaffed. It's okay. It's okay. I wouldn't mind helping out. I appreciate it, but we need mods who are familiar with FF14, unfortunately. But that's okay, though. That's okay, though. We have delayed uh, Endwalker, by the way. We have been talking about pussies, pizza, and Kelsey being lonely as fuck for the last, like, I don't know how long. Let me, let's, let's, uh, let, yeah, mm, let me, uh, let me just inspect these footprints real quick. <laughs> let me just do a little, a little inspector -oo. I probably could have been doing this while we've been complaining. A trail of fresh footprints lead east. All right, okay. Let's go. Oh, found more. But I'm too far behind to be of any help. That's okay, Dennis. I appreciate it. I would volunteer, but I'm unhinged as a person to be a mod. That's okay. That's all you need. Pussy and pizza. The two Ps. We need that pee pee, baby. Just need some pee pee. <gasps> More footprints. These footprints appear to be the same as those you saw previously and they lead towards the building. <gasps> so where the babies are. I would volunteer but I'm retired and modern gaming is like, don't worry, dissatisfied. Don't worry. It's okay. I've accumulated with 2.3 hours and 14 since you've been gone. I think I'm still at like the 4K realm. I'd offer if I wasn't recovering for a big sick. It's okay, Jacko. Don't worry. I love how everyone right now is like, I would help, but I can't. I would help, but eat shit. <laughs> Don't worry, it's 
okay, y'all. It's totally fine. It's totally fine. Kelsey will be okay for now. <laughs> Kelsey will be okay for now. I hope. But unfortunately, I'm way across in Europe. <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? No one wants to work these days? I know. It's all right, though. We're good. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. I won't help. I'll make a ruckus instead. Riot! Down with the system! You know what? I fuck with your energy. I fuck with the energy. It's bedtime for reasonable people here, Syra. Um, I don't know how to tell you this, Soren, but if you're in my chat, you are not a reasonable person. If you're in my chat and you think you're reasonable, I got a rude awakening for you. <laughs> All right, let's look at my babies. According to the label here, this place used to be used, was used by those involved with extracting ceruleum. Mm. We're getting closer. I'm sure of it. At first, we thought she'd gone inside the building, but the door doesn't look to have been opened in some time. She might still be nearby, so we'll keep looking around here. But again, it's also possible that she ran right past this place. Do you mind searching up ahead? Yeah, I got you, babes. I've got you. Let me go inspect the feet again. Oh, wait, there are no footprints. What are you- what do you want me to inspect? There's no footprints here. Oh, I'm just surveying. Ah, yes. We're look- we're looking around. We're looking that way. We're looking this way. We're looking that way. We're looking back this way. Oh, we're going over here again and over here. And... Oh! Oh. Quite a scene, babe. Just a quite a scene. It's quite a scene time. Girl in the green dress anxiously surveys her surroundings. We need to call out to her from the assistance. It might attract wild beasts to your, to your location. It'd be safer to get closer first, but you must do so without drawing her attention. You want me to just fucking sneak up on this child? Game? Hello? Alright, okay. Follow the girl from a safe distance. The objective will end in failure if you are noticed. Make sure make use of cover such as rocks to approach her without being seen. Similarly, the objective will also end in failure if you fall too far behind. Should you fail to complete the objective, you may try again by returning to the designated location. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, can I run? Can I run after her? <gasps> it's a wild wasp. <gasps> Pant. She's panting. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. Is this good? Oh god. She's looking at me. Am I, at a, am I at a safe distance? So far, so good. Is she scared of me? What the fuck are these enemies, by the way? Not you, Vosk. I didn't mean to click on you. Who are you? Stay away. No! I failed! She couldn't see me from there? I was trying to... I was trying to look at these fuckers. What the hell is this? It's like ten marbles on top of each other. With tentacles. Overgrown rose... Damn, that's a cool design, actually. I kind of fuck with it, but holy. Why is there a mystical butt plug above the snow? Do not question the mystical butt plug. Final Fantasy XIV is known for their butt plugs. You should appreciate it more. Foyinski! Yes, I'm British, babes. I am. I didn't know how to tell you all this, but I'm actually British. Yeah. I'm reasonable, gifting over 1,300 subs just because I could. Um, yeah, 1,300 is not enough, though. <laughs> all right, now, all right, we're going to follow the girl again. And this time, I'm not going to get caught. All right, Vosk. I'm going to hide behind you again. For protection. Okay. I think we're good here. Can she see me if I jump? Do you think she can see me if I jump? Oh! Oh, fuck. I think she's... Oh, my God! Jumping gave away my location! The AI is too strong. Holy. <laughs> God. Okay. Let's do this again. All right. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. You can't see me. I'm going up here. I'm going up here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. 
chat, be very quiet. Be very quiet. Very quiet now. Shh. Shh. Oh. Shh. Shh. Don't make a sound. <gasps> Slay. All right, we fucking move. <coughs> I choked on my spit saying that. Oh fuck, where am I gonna hide now? What if an enemy targets me? Oh god, oh god. She's walking so fucking slow. Do I tackle her? Do I hide behind a tree? Oh, do not crinkle crinkle in my ear, Mr. Enemy. Okay. I fear she's gonna turn around now. Oh god. No, there is nobody here. No, you're going crazy. You're going crazy. You're hearing things. Yeah, you are. You're just imagining things. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry. You're completely safe. Oh, shit. She's running. This is kind of creepy. This is actually kind of creepy. Why can we just, yeah, like, approach her? Also, guys. Like. Hey, chat. Stay quiet. It's sneaking time. <laughs> Dentist, you fuck. She's gonna catch us. She's gonna fucking catch us. What did I say? What did I say? Oh. Those beasts spot me. I'm done for. Girl, I could, I can take care of the beasts. I got you. I want to take you to safety. I want to take care of you, child I do not know. Damn. Maybe I am creepy. Where is she, like, leading us? Is she gonna take me to this other etherite? Tertium? I hope my luck holds. I hope it does too. She barely walked like fucking 10 feet and she's already turning around. Girl, you're good. Go! She's fucking surveying. I know, right? Like, this is way less suspicious, right? I like how she could just see her minion think nothing is. Oh! No! No! Oh my fucking god! Uh, you're kidding! No! I did not expect her to do the quick turnaround! Oh my god! Ah, oh, chat. I fucked up. I fucked up. Alright, here I go. Ah, GG's. Fucking GG. I can be your Endwalker spoiler mod. Can you? You're all caught up with MSQ and everything, right? This mission had me tight? Hey, yo. This mission ain't the only thing that's got me tight. What? Anyway. Why did it have you tight? What does that mean? <laughs> What do you what did you mean by that? What did you mean by that? No, 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 no. Chat, don't look at me funny. They said it. Sumi said it, not me. They're the one that said they're tight, okay? <coughs> this one took me a few tries. Yeah, it's gonna take me more than a few tries with fucking dentist screaming. Thank you, Vosk. Don't blow my cover! I see you- I see you fucking cheering me on. You're up through 6.4? Okay. Ulmo, I am trusting you. This is a big deal, okay? You're about to get big dick energy. This is a really big deal, alright? I'm trusting you. Every time I come here, sorry, I say crazy that? I say crazy that? Crazy, that's crazy. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. Tight is slang I remember hearing in DC slash VA. But like that shit is tight. Yeah, I know it as like that's really cool as opposed to like I was tight. Cause like if someone told me that they were tight, I'd be like, oh, like do you want me to recommend some lube? You know? Blaming me for your mission failure, of course. Of course. You are both the bane of my existence and the Oh my god. And the object of my desire. 
or whatever the fucking quote is. Dude, if someone said that to me, though, like, I'm sorry. Bridgerton season two, fuck my pussy up raw. Raw, I tell you. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to see if, like, oh, maybe not. I want to go up the um the thing here. Oh, it's way further than I thought. Oh, I hope I don't lose her. I hope I don't lose her. I hope I don't lose her. Ah, I hope I don't lose her. No! I failed to follow my objective. I'm going to fucking shit down my own throat. But yeah, no, Bridgerton season two was so good. And it's like what made me obsessed with, um, fuck, what's his, oh my God, what is Anthony Bridgerton's name? What's Graha Tia's voice actor's name again? Man, hearing him in this game just gets me, it just gets me. No, no, not the, I was crazy once. Psych words are the true universities of life, excuse me? <laughs> what? Ray, my night's going okay. I mean, I'm getting fucked by this, uh, by this little quest here, but you know, I'm chilling. How are you? Are you here to mod? Are you here to save Kelsey? <clears throat> I know, I'm also sleepy and hungry. Well, not sleepy, I'm just hungry. I have no clue if my partner got the pizza. How much you want to bet that he's skateboarding right now and completely forgot? Remember how I said I should text him quickly before he forgets and shit? Oh, he's at the skate park. Oh, I'm done for. Oh, I'm starving tonight. I'm starving, chat. This is the last time you'll ever see me. I'm gonna die. This is how I die. I'm watching you in game going back and forth. Oh, wait, are you Guts? No, wait, no, you're not Guts. Wait, where are you? Otaku, thank you for the raid. Hello, hello. Thank you, thank you. How was your stream going? Hi, friends. I'm Sire. I'm a Final Fantasy XIV streamer, and we have finally returned to Endwalker. Oh, you are Guts. Okay. You're just watching me run back and forth. That is so embarrassing. Am I here to mod? Hey, are you? <clears throat> oh, shit. That would be an inauspicious uh, start. Wait, what? That'd be an inauspicious start to my modding streamer immediately fucking dies. I know, right? <laughs> Could you imagine? Hi, Banana Nose. Banana Nose. Banana Nose is a good viewer. Well, I love them already. They're using my little high emotes and I appreciate it. We're not a lot, but we're the best. Hey, look, it's just a number. View count is just a number, baby. There's the right way, the wrong way, and the Syra way. Can you, like, explain to me what the Syra way is? Like, what does that entail? I forgot I was on a low-level job. Mistakes were made. Voss, did you fucking die? Where did you go? Do you need me to res you? Oh! Vosk! If I res you... Will she... Will she see it? Oh my god. She's gonna see her dead body and run away. <laughs> do y'all think, do y'all think if I, if I res Vosk? Come on, 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 come on. Slay, slay, slay. Oh my god. Yes, yes. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh my god. You do not see me? You do not see me? We're good. We're chilling. We're good. We're chilling. We're chilling. Gotta keep going. They're all depending on me. Who is they? <coughs> Who's depending on her? Is it the final spurt? Okay, we're getting close. All right. Okay. There's a rock right here. I better not have to use this tree. I better be able to just use this fucking rock. Ooh, she's going up to this like mansion thingy. Mm. Oh my God, okay. 
Oh, I think we're good. I think we're good. This is home stretch. Oh, we're chilling. Oh, we're fucking chilling. Oh, we're fucking golden, baby. Oh, we're golden, pony boy. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Yay! Whew. Still in one piece. The ominous music. I'm concerned. Oh, she's a garland. Who are you? Stay back. This house is packed with explosives. Take another step and I'll blow this place sky high. Oh my god, girl, chill. Please, we just want to talk. Why did I say it like that? We just want to talk. I'm Alfie now. This is my sister, Alize, and her good friend, Peppa. We have no intention of hurting or taking anything from you or anyone else. I'll give you my word. We and our comrades have come to provide aid to the people of Garlemald. Aid? You savages are the ones responsible for all of this. You did this to us. We didn't, I promise you. One of the other reasons we came was to find out what was what happened here, yeah, in fact. Whoa. <coughs> Fucked up that sentence really bad. The Tlofaro are the ones to blame. They're the ones who laid waste to Garlemald, and they won't stop until they destroy the entire world. They're the enemy. Our enemy. On our way, we encountered Imperial soldiers. Soldiers who had, ma who had been made their thralls. Those poor souls are now in our care, and we are striving to cure them of their affliction. You're the first person we've met who ha who wasn't already enslaved. How were you able to escape the Tlofaro's influence? Are there any others like you? I'm sorry, I don't mean to overwhelm you. Let's start with instructions. Can you tell me your name? I... My name's Licinia. Licinia? Or is it like Italian? Licinia! As for how I managed to say sane. Honestly, I kind of want to go Licinia! I feel like that's like the vibe. I feel like that's it. You know? But I have to say it like that each time. Every single time her name comes up. Legenia! Mamma mia! Pepperoni! You know? <coughs> I've been asking myself the same question ever since that night. And the roar, that terrible roar. And then the screams. I was screaming too, I think. I'm not sure. I can't remember. And then came the silence. Everything was still. It was like waking up from a nightmare. I thought that maybe the fighting had stopped, so I stepped outside. If your hells are real, I saw one that day. I ran, past friends, people I'd known all my life. Eyes vacant, dead, staring at the sky. Others were mad and violent. I saw them struggle with soldiers, but didn't stay to watch. I fled as far as my legs would take me. <clears throat> <coughs> Do you have family here? Is this their home? No. This is my Victor's spoils. Oh, this is Victor's spoils. A mansion for retired soldiers. Or it was. But now me and my... Me and a few others are, um, borrowing it. As for the explosives. I was making that up. I just wanted to keep everyone else safe. And I didn't know if you were. <sighs> the truth is, our supplies are running low. You said you're here to help. Can you? Of course. Whatever assistance we, pr we can provide, we will. Thank you. I better tell the others first, though. Wait here. Hey, your hair matches! I just noticed! Love that. Oh, not the really overwhelmingly sad music that makes me cry. <laughs> this is everyone. Legenia says you can be trusted. But these are desperate times. We'd be fools to let foreign troops into our home. Having said that, were you to provide us with means of heating the place as a sign of goodwill, perhaps we could take you at your word. Oh, sickly refugee, they're sick! They're sick! If that's too much to ask, then leave us be. Why does this guy just look like Jay but blonde? You know? 
tend to put my firewood gathering skills to use. Could you provide the spark with a little magic, Alize? <coughs> we'll have a fire burning in no time. Maybe build it under that gazebo. The what? Oh, you mean the boa? Yes, yes, do as you will. Why is she looking at me funny? What was that about? Why was she looking at me funny? Hey yo, we got fucking mod chat going on. We summon Ray and he's the only one fucking chitter chattering. How are you, Jessica? Hey yo, my name ain't Jessica. Who's Jessica? Jessica have you cried yet drew I have not cried yet I have not cried I'm scared though I have a bad feeling I'm gonna start crying this stream because we're playing for the next like three to four hours she got nice brows the the girl Latina she does same though brow queens brows to studs yeah Ray if you're playing league you're taking the L immediately <coughs> I like Jessica. She seems nice. Does she? Her name is Jessica. How nice could Jessica possibly be? Are Jessica's ever actually nice? All right. <coughs> okay. But yeah, that was so weird. It's like... We had to stalk this girl, and then all of a sudden she was, like, open to discussion. Do you know what I mean? Why didn't we just stop her from the get-go? We have magic and shit, you know? Ooh, now I'm getting my quest from her. Okay, Missy. Yo, we're gonna hit level 90 for Gunbreaker tonight. Latinia's inner turmoil is writ plain on her face. Garlands get sick from ether. You can't just magic and shit. They can eat my ass. They could eat my ass, Ray. Like, how hard is it to outpace a small child? Well, she's clearly not a small child. Look at her beside Pepper. You know what I mean? This is a whole ass woman. They really thought, like, they had me thinking I was chasing, like, chasing a child. You know? I had a crush on a girl named Jessica when I was in fourth grade. She bullied me all the time. Really explains a lot now. Yeah, dentist, that does not surprise me. You've always been the same. Magic can't solve all our problems, Syrah. Well, you know what? Why do we have magic then? I had a crush on a manager named Jessica 17 years ago. Am I the only person who had a bad experience with Jessica? Whoa, what am I hearing? Tears begin. And so, oh, oh, the tears begin. Oh. Oh. How have you been? It's been so long. <laughs> I know nothing about this game. All you need to know is that this man right here is my husband and he's abandoned me more than once and I can't go through that shit again. Oh, I'm getting head pats. I, I see you still wear our old ribbon. How could I not? How could I not still wear the ribbon? Of course I still wear the ribbon. It is my most deepest prized possession. Of course. Red is the color of passion, the fire in your heart, fierce and bright. It binds you and your family, you and your friends, you and me. I'm gonna jump off a bridge. I'm gonna jump off a bridge. I can never part with it. I wouldn't dare. <laughs> He's gasping to, to prep for getting hit in the, take that back. Take that back. That is cruel. 
That is absolutely cruel. You know, you know who I miss the most? I miss Pepperfont. I don't know where he went. I went to be and came back and you're crying. Hey, I'm not crying yet. But where are my manners? Please, dear, have this one. <laughs> I'm strong. I'm strong. I'm so strong. I'm such a strong girl. I'm not gonna cry over it. I should have a role player giving me hot chalky in the cold. No, I'm strong. I'm so strong. I'm so strong. Um, here, I, I have a little poop that fell out of my skirt. If you would, if you would have it, I can also give you some peppermint. So I'm also always with you, you know? I feel like that's like a really fair trade. You know? <laughs> it's a really good trade. I'm not crying, I'm fine. I'm just a little sniffly, that's all. <coughs> Are you feeling unwell? Just a bit cold. I'll be, I'll be all right. How do I delete things the streamer says? <laughs> Unfortunately, you have to endure. You have to endure, just like I do. Now that you're here to land, now feels much warmer with you by my side once again. Uh, or Shabbat, you can't just say these things to me. You can't, you can't. I'm honored. I'm glad that my presence helps you feel warm. I'm all you need. I'm like a warm blanket. I'm like a heating pad. You know, I am a cat after all. Just put me on your lap and I'll keep you nice and cozy. You know? You can just, I can just purr a little bit. You can feel the, the rhythmic purr. Oh, I get head pads. Thank you. Thank you for the head pads. I appreciate. <laughs> I'll just go nya every so often and we're good. You know? You know? I have so many big boys around me. I'm blushing. I feel like I've seen this video. I've seen this video somewhere. But are you here to assist these poor Garlean souls as well? <coughs> ah! I am, actually! They didn't seem like they wanted much help at first. But it's time to keep them warm, too. <laughs> oh, you need a big girl around you too I just need a lot of big people I just need a lot of big people around Pepper at all times that's what she needs that's what she deserves that's what she deserves Pepper likes them big you know you know do what you will with that information Do what you will with that information. Unfortunately, I must part. I must get back to business. I'll miss you. <laughs> mm. I just loaded into Limsa, and the first thing anyone said was Venus. Limsa core. Honestly, Limsa core. I still love that I incorporated Limsa Lamenta into Pepper's lore. Did I tell y'all that? Did I tell y'all about Pepper lore? So Pepper wanted to get into Charlian because she wanted to... Um, so Pepper wa- Oh, Drew! Drew, thank you for the five gifts and subs! Drop video link now. You are not getting the Pepper porn. No pussy for you. At least not yet. Y'all are not getting the NSFW Pepper yet. <gasps> go, Pepper. Go be the hero we always believed you were, even when you found it hard to believe. I'm gonna suck you off so good tonight. <laughs> but... <laughs> the, so... <laughs> the Pepper lore... 
the pepper lore that I come up with was <laughs> <coughs> um, the pepper lore that I that I came up with was that she wanted to go to like Charlian to improve her magic and you know be strong and smart enough to help her clan because um, they're a very poor clan but unfortunately pepper is really dumb bimbo energy and she didn't make it so instead runner up she went to limsa laminsa to study um magic there instead so she literally went to college in lenosha and all i'm saying is look limsa laminsa is crazy and if you go to college in lenosha shit about to go wild Hey yo, wait. Orshifon said he's not saying no to me sucking his dick. Now hold on. Now hold on. Do I have a treat for you, bestie? Pepper moves quick like a fucking chocobo. Fucking got 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 got. Okay, I'm going back to the MSQ. Bye. I don't know where I'm going actually. Ah! Okay, I'm going over here. <laughs> Gawk and go. Gawk and go. I'm sorry. I love you. I'm a little embarrassed. I'm a little shy. I didn't want you. I didn't want everyone to see me do that. I didn't want everyone to see me gawk gawk you in public like that. There was a lot of people there. I, got, I was too in the moment. I was too in the moment. Don't look at the pepper lips. Don't look at the lips. All right. What's up? You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. You didn't see any of that, right? You didn't hear me. You didn't hear the gawk gawk, right? You still want my help? You still good? You still trust me in Alfie you know and Alice, eh? Yeah? Good. <clears throat> How the mighty are fallen. All right, let's get into this. Hmm? Sorry, I was... I'm still finding it hard to come to terms with all that's happened. Now that you're here, though, I'm hoping things might change for the better. You know, I've worked up quite a sweat from all that running about. So I'll leave space around the fire for the others. You know what? I also just worked up a sweat. You see that tall, handsome man over there? Yeah, my throat's a little sore right now. <clears throat> it's been a while. Wait. Did I read what she just said? <laughs> did, I, did I read what she just said? Did I read that? I don't know. Anyway. As you can tell, they're in a far worse state than me. We are planning to look for somewhere warmer with more food, but they're not going anywhere until we nurse them back to health, which I don't know how to do. Is there anything you could do to help them? Yes. Oh, I'm doing a walk of shame back to my husband, apparently. Bye! All right, there's Alfie now. Where is a mandolin? Oh yeah, mandolin went back, right? All right. I can treat the frostbite and the wounds, but it'll take time for the fire to do its work. Now be a good occasion to make use of Manalian's tinctures. The ones that can warm the body from the inside out. Hey yo. From the inside out? Hey yo, Orshfant. Your brother knows a thing or two about warming people from the inside out. Do you know anything about that? Bro, this like fucking Garlean propaganda. Hi. I see you in the corner there. Dentist, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, most massively. Oh, hey, yo. Look at those guns. <gasps> He's about to play a song. <clears throat> Would you make sure everyone gets one? Yeah, of course. Let me give them some goods. Let me give them some goods. Hello, sickly refugee. I got something for you. The numbness is beginning to subside. The respect once the fire dies, it will return with a vengeance. We have four warming tinctures, but there's only like three of them. Oh, I guess we're gonna give one to the Italian as well, right? Warming tincture? I've never heard of such a thing. Oh, how am I trying? Tell me, have you heard out of the city? They're calling it that seems absurd after what's happened. It's nothing but ruins now. The few buildings still standing offer no more than meager protection from wind and snow. Food production, water purification, the magic set that sustained us has come to a grinding halt. What machina that remains operational cannot be run for lack of ceruleum. Of course, cerulea ingens is full of the stuff for all the good it does us. 
<clears throat> no one here knows the first thing about extraction or refinement. Alright, let's give it to this one now. Oi! You're in the way! All is well. Yes, never better. I can make it better, though. Oh, you're bidding for well. Bye, Resi. Take care. Thank you for hanging out. Oh, what limitation? Oh, is that a ray? What limitation is this? Is it poison by any chance? <laughs> it was a joke. A joke. <laughs> if I laughed, is that I may not weep? So said the poet. And alas, my tears would freeze on my cheek if they fell. We are the blessed damned to bear witness to the fall of the great empire while our brethren lie dead or live on as puppets of flesh. First came the war, then came the roar. When morning came, Garlemald was no more. In the cacophony of gunfire, explosions and screams was our beloved capital to raise, oh, capital raised to the ground. From the rubble rose the disheveled remnants, the lavish finery caked in ash as they shuffled mindlessly towards the palace. Each barren fragment of stone or metal, an offering perhaps to the architect of her destruction. A hopeful few try to reason with the deranged, only to be beaten for their kindness. Wait, this is kind of sad. This is making me really sad. But I knew better than to plead with the horde. I fled with my health, if not my conscience preserved. And I wait with my fellow cowards for a final judgment. Cowards? No, don't say that. Or she, this is making me sad. Truly. What do you want? Bro, I'm trying to keep you warm. Hmm? A tincture. <laughs> May as well drink it, I suppose. Didn't even question it. I could be killing him right now. <coughs> this it's a radio you don't have them where you come from i take it <clears throat> use them to listen to messages sent by others even other even over great distances does pepper not know what a radio is pepper you have like record players in your home now different swipe twipes they're different twipes they're different types but this model is by far the most popular made with quality components crafted with the finest ore source from locus aminus Amonus? Among us? When all that useful since the capital fell into ruin, the people at the broadcasting station must have either fled or ended up like all the others. Because all we've been hearing is the same music being played over and over again. Home beyond the horizon. An ode to the brave men and women sent to reclaim our ancestral home of Locus Among Us. Among among Ammonius. <laughs> we may have founded an empire in these frozen ways, but we always hope to take back what was once ours. It is a solemn reminder that though we must suffer great hardship, better days will surely come. Despite everything, I believe the Emperor Varus yet lives. And he speaks to us through our radios. It was a cunning strategy, faking his murder. Hmm. He must have foreseen the catastrophe and chosen to conceal himself, that he may one day make his triumphant return. Yes, yes, I'm sure of it. Emperor Varus would not be defeated so easily. about that are you helping out too babes yeah thank you you're so helpful talking to the radio thank you thank you Orshi. i really appreciate it truly <laughs> i have to go over here though if you want to assist me what are you t ray don't jump don't jump whatever you do do not jump you have so much to live for oh It's nice to see you. Welcome back. Welcome back. Oh, Bunny! <gasps> Bunny wearing the Orshi armor! Hello, Rissy! <laughs> now we just need a mandolin. Dearest, oh dearest, a mandolin. Nice elbows? Hey, don't look at my elbows like that. Don't look at my elbows like that. 
Do I still need to mod now? I mean, potentially, but it's up to you. I think we might be okay. Chat is like pretty tame right now. <clears throat> oh wait, did you literally? Oh, you did, cause you weren't subbed. You resubbed just to come say hi to me. Aww, Ray, are you my friend? Hi, Side Four. Hello, hello. Okay, one second, chat. I need to just check something. My za should be approaching any moment. Ponto! Only time ill sub. Are you telling me you're a dummy? I don't believe it. I've seen you cower at the things I've said. I've seen you cower under my words, okay? <coughs> Don't tell Jixen. Because my delusional mental boom about League of Legends? Is that why? Did you literally come back to FF14 because of League? That's kind of iconic of you. But out of like every game too though. Oh, I scared off your chat. You did. It's because you stink. Sorry, one second, chat. How much does that pizza cost? Just wondering. Um, If I'm not wrong, probably around... Let me see. Let me see what it was in my cart because I sent him a screenshot. So, let's see. $22.50... Uh, twenty six eighty four, and then with tip, it was probably like thirty bucks. I'm on the fence about queuing up another. Hey, look, it's up to you. Be strong, be strong. I would not queue up another game of league. I finished my food and have regrets. Why do you have regrets? You're not scared of me, Ponzo? I don't believe that. I don't believe that in the slightest. Hello, another bunny. Are you, are you here for me? Are you all here for me? Ah! Wait, that jump is sick. That jump is so sick. I'm obsessed. You're so fucking cool. <clears throat> I've launched League Legends client three times this year and then closed it and discussed about playing a game. Good for you. Good for you. <laughs> if you had a few drinks and you would probably be scared. What does that mean? Hold on. Ponto, what does that mean? What do you mean by that? Oh, Blacksmith Bunny is you? Hello, Blacksmith Bunny. Who are these other people chit-chatting? I see them shouting. Is it you? Santos, thank you for the $30 donut. I appreciate it. Don't worry about it. No, I am worrying, Ponto. Baldur's Gate 3 patch just dropped. Oh, yeah. What's in the... What was in the patch? Is it just the, um... T the magic mirror? <gasps> Nap. Nappy, nappy. I would be scared, too. Why would you be scared, Guts? Why is everyone afraid of me? Why is everyone scared of me? I'm just a sweet bean! Wait, did I add you yet? There we go. <coughs> a ton of fixes and Mac support. Wait, you're telling me I could play that game on Mac? I could play Baldur's Gate 3 on my MacBook so I can go to my mom's and flirt with my vampire boyfriend? Yo, slay. Wait, your outfit is lit. <gasps> you're so hot! Oh my god, you're so hot. Oh, all the big people for Pepper. All the big people for Pepper! Today's a good day. Today's a fucking good day to be Pepper. Look at that view. Wait, I forgot how to... Oh, look at that view. Are you kidding? Oh, did I get a little smile? I get a little smile. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Like, I'm actually gonna cry. You know how hard it is to, like, see Orshifa in game? Because, like, I don't see him anymore, you know? Like, like I, don't, I don't see him in game. I don't get to see, like, like, his character model in the game anymore. I just see that, like, damn portrait of him in Kim Oh my god, I'm literally crying! I guess... <laughs> like, I'm not looking forward 
to replaying Heaven's Word. <laughs> like, I. It's gonna fuck me up. Like, it's gonna fucking ruin me. And, like, we'll get to. Like, I'm gonna replay, like, the series when. When I finish like, catching up to 6.5. But, like. It just fucking stings. Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. This is so embarrassing. You're literally a role player and I'm crying! <laughs> Why is this what gets me to 67? Like... Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Pizza's here. I got saved by the pizza. Rissy is me, just in case you're wondering. Oh my god, your username is Cat Girl Fanatic? Oh, you're gonna love me then, and I'm gonna love you. Well, you don't see him because he's dead. Larry, I don't need the reminder. If Orshwan gets you to 69, that'll be hard to explain, or maybe really easy. Oh god, I hope he gets me to 69. And knowing my luck with this game, I will. Like, that will be what gets me to 69. Yes, it's pizza time. Let me go grab my za. Your headset is so cute. Thank you. It's just a normal headset by Vimoda, but with my logo on it and the alligator, like, um, or crocodile skin thing. These are just my Mikote ears. Okay, let me go get my pizza. There is no pizza. Waldo barked at nothing. Waldo barked at nothing. <laughs> I thought the saw was there. I literally texted my boyfriend, I'm gonna suck your dick so good. And there's no pizza. There's no pizza. I thought this whole time. Well, you know what? It got me to stop crying. So at least there's that. <coughs> What did I just join? <laughs> Amy, hello! Look, I'm waiting for my pizza. I'm waiting for my pizza. I want my saw. I want food in my belly. But I'm not getting any. I know. I know. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine, chat. It's not like I wanted my pizza anyways. This is fine. This is okay. I'll mold later. You know? Words and such, hello, it's nice to see ya. Hello, hello. Oh, he's barking again. Oh, do you hear him? He's wooing. Waldo is wooing. Is it finally happening? Did my Zog get here? I'm gonna head to bed. Good to have Pepper back. Bye, Ted Sister. It was nice seeing you here. Thank you for the gifted subbies and the. Okay, Waldo is smelling under the door. This might be it. This might be my pizza. And if this is actually my pizza. I'm so happy. Who needs delivery notification when you got Waldo, eh? No, actually, though. Waldo is my notification. He's my doorbell. <laughs> okay, let me just let my, my partner know that it arrived safely. Oh, and then we can return to the MSQ.
He got me dipped too? Slay. Slay! Ugh. Y'all ready? Y'all ready to see this? <gasps> Fuck me! Oh my god, chat! Yo! I'm eating good. Oh my god. Hi, bestie. I'm trying to take like a cute photo, but I'm like not cute enough. <laughs> you know? Hi, Wado. What's the dip? It's a chili infused olive oil. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, chat, I'm so happy now. <sighs> All right. Are y'all ready to get comfy and cozy? Ready for some more MSQ? Okay. All right. Ready? First, let me, like, take a bite. This pizza, like, looks really good. Normally, the pizza doesn't look this cheesy, but this looks, like, amazing. Mm. Oh, my God, chat. Oh, my God. Mmm. Oh, yeah. I'm a happy cat girl. Chat, I know we were talking about pizza earlier, but have the rest of you eaten? Is anyone going to eat pizza with me? Mmm. Mmm. Had dinner before stream. Pizza was yesterday too. Mm -hmm. This is definitely a pizza week. Definitely a pizza week. You're eating bratwurst. Isn't that like a sausage? <clears throat> So you're just eating sausages? Honestly, kind of a serve. This is definitely the right place to be eating sausages, too. Done buns with mustard? Ooh, but Dijon mustard? What kind of mustard? Mm. <laughs> Wait. Look at them. This is so cute. <clears throat> yes, Dijon, fuck yeah. Mmm. Mm. Hi, Ash. You're eating lentil soup and falafel? Fuck yeah. Oh my god. See, now I still want soup. Mmm. <laughs> Lentil soup is really yummy. Mmm. I love doll. I love doll so much. <clears throat> I ate a cold sub because it's the best. My girl made it before she left. Okay. Actually, you know what? You know what I find to be really underrated? Cold sandwiches. You know? I don't need my sandwich to be, like, steaming hot. I don't need, like, my my burger. Well, my burger I want to be, like, warm, but not hot, you know? Creepy Smith Groovy, hello! Welcome to the coven! I gotta go to sleep before I need to make a 3 a.m. snack. Night-night! Bye, Soren! Thank you for hanging out! It's true, you can't fuck it up. You cannot fuck up a sandwich. <clears throat> I made a grilled cheese sandwich for my partner the other day, and he said it was too soft. 
Do you like your grilled cheese sandwiches soft or like crunchy? I don't like mine to be too crunchy. I need to be, it needs to be like a little on the soft side or like more on the soft side. I want to, I want to be able to like fold it. The sandwiches in general I like crunch. Mm. I don't like the crunch that much. I like the tenderness. Why does the motorcycle have to fart? Was it tooting? I'm okay with a flaccid sandwich. Slay. Actually, slay. No, oh, Guts is still here. Let me take like another bite of this pizza. I did not realize how hungry I was until now. I promise we'll get back to the MSQ. I'm going at the world's slowest pace, but can you blame me? I got distracted by pizza, you know? Mm. Is your bodyguard I have to be? I like how you think. I actually like how you think. Protect the president, baby. Protect the president. Mm. 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 <clears throat> mm mm mm. Mm 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 mm. 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 Do you ever eat something so good that you just want to dance? Cuz sometimes I do a happy dance when I'm eating. You know, like just like Food's so good, it literally makes me act up. I truly, this is exactly what I needed. You do a happy dance when you see that I'm live? Sean, you're so sweet. How are you? How are you doing? I just do a little wiggle. I do a side of wiggle. Mm. My stream literally went from MSQ to crying over Orshifat to eating pizza. I'm so sorry for this, like, quick intermission. Sometimes you don't realize you're hungry until you start eating, you know? Mm. Yeah, you gotta fold the pizza! You gotta fold the pizza so you can put it all in your mouth. This is, like... Thin crust for the most part. Oh shit. I almost got the oil all over me. You know? <clears throat> you gotta fold it. And then do your little dip. You know? Mmm. 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 The cold sub. Have you ever ate cold sub so good then drink the perfect cold water? Oh my god. Cold water is so yummy. <clears throat> my favorite type of weather is when you go outside and it feels like 
a glass of cold water. You know what I mean? Like, the weather just feels like refreshing water. Mmm. 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 Are y'all enjoying just watching me eat pizza? <clears throat> y'all thought you were getting Endwalker and all you got instead was pizza and down horrendousness. Mmm. Okay. I have one slice left. But I will save it. Mmm. Mm. I can't stop moaning. Mm. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. We are tuning. We are tuning. That was so good. <clears throat> Pizza was a really good decision chat. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm about to leave for the night. Bye, presently. Thank you for hanging out with us. I'm gonna throw my grandpappy in bed and I'm gonna lock in on the stream. As you should. Hello, Naomi. What's up? All right, pizza done. Let me crack open this little, this little Twinkie. All right. Oh, we're about to have a good ass stream. And by good ass stream, I mean my tummy is happy so nothing could go wrong. All right, ready? Ready chat? All right. <clears throat> Let's get into this. What's that? Here you go. I've got a warming tincture for you, babes. <gasps> Cutscene. This is what you gave the others. Thank you. I'll save it for later. Actually, I have a few things to ask you. Are you part of the group staying in late run? The latter run? I saw Legatus Vigilia's troops heading towards the Magnus Gracias, I'd say pronounce it right, a few days ago. Are they the ones you encountered? Excuse me, I'm going to stop and walk myself. Camp Broken Class, you call it. And Vigilia and her men are all there now. Hmm. So how did you reach the Magnus Gracias? Did you cross the mountains on foot? Excuse me, I'm going to stop and walk myself. Airships. There might be a way to... Lachinia! Where is everyone? Is there a child in there? Is something the matter? Oh, <gasps> Who are you hiding? A voice from inside, you say? You must be imagining things. Everyone's out here. I knew something was up. Too fucking good to be true. Perhaps the baby on... On Masty? Almost has found its way into the house. It wouldn't be the first time. That sword to scare them off while the animals have been roaming close to the settlements. Some have known to attack people too. <clears throat> I just had an idea. If you knew you were strong enough to defeat the Legatus, then surely a few beasts shouldn't pose a threat. 
you would have, if you've a mind to see helping us, perhaps you could head over, head to the other side of the lake. There's a small group of tappers living there, people whose job was to extract ceruleum. Still do, from what we can tell. <coughs> I've already tried asking if they would share the fuel with us, but they're not willing to give it away. They want food in exchange, lots of food, and that's something we don't have and can't get on our own. On top of that, to even reach their den, we'd have to make our past, make our way past all those creatures. Something is fishy. Something is sus. Something is sus as shit. I don't trust this. I don't like this. I don't like her anymore. I don't like this Italian lady anymore. Would you be willing to go in our place? We only need enough ceruleum to last until the others are strong enough to travel to our camp. The officer stands at us. Oh, I don't expect you to give up your, oh, your own supplies, but there might be another way to pay the tappers. <coughs> if it's ceruleum you need, then ceruleum you should have. You'd best watch out for baby El Masties while we're away. Hmm? Ah, yes, of course. If I see any, I'll be sure to shoo them away. To reach Tapper's den, you'll have to cross the lake. The ice is thick enough to support a person's weight, but if you'd rather not take the risk, you'll need to take the long way around. Finding the entrance can be a bit tricky too, so it's easy to just look for someone sending guard outside. If ever you decide to head there, please be careful. This feels like a trap. This actually feels like a trap. Goob. Goob. I love that. Loki obsessed with that. I don't think I've ever actually seen like a green esque aura or Auri, I guess. Never. <gasps> Hello, Lax. How are you? It's nice to see you. I haven't seen you in a hot minute. How you doing? When are you coming back to FF14? Hi, Caleb! And hi, Mystic Skies! Hello! <coughs> You're gonna see trappers. How could that be a trap? You know what? I couldn't tell. Well, we're seeing tappers. How about to get that ass tapped? But that's not what we want. This definitely is gonna be a trap. We're gonna get fucked up. We're gonna get fucked up. Pepper's gonna get kidnapped. Pepper is too baby for this! Pepper is just a sweet little, little lass. She's done nothing wrong ever in her entire life. And now she's getting tricked by Garleans? Like we just let that woman gaslight us. Pepper just got gaslit and she's rolling with it? <coughs> I don't believe it. I'm not falling for this at all. Hello Invader, hello, hello, welcome. I've been here for a month now. Oh you, my god, you've been in Copenhagen for a month? Holy moly. Burly Tapper. Hey look, my bodyguard is here. <coughs> Who goes there? How'd you find us? What do you mean I stand like a sore thumb? <laughs> the pure bloods over at Victor Spoils hadn't given away our about. And give it away our location. You'd never have found us. Those stuck up assholes. Thought they could come waltzing in here demanding cerulean with that with nothing to offer in return. Ha! Looks like the boots on the other foot now, the capital has gone to shite. So if it's sort of sending you to negotiate. Oh, I know your game. Cell sword. Oh, I know your game, Cell Sword. They think that we'll give you a bit of If they think we'll give in to intimidation, they've got another thing coming. Oh shit. Oh. <coughs> Damn, it'd be like that. It'd actually be like that. I didn't expect a fucking brawl. Oh my bad, wrong ability. Oh, the combat music is like so good. Eat my ass! Eat my ass! Easy. Am I dead yet? Yeah, you fucking may as well be. Where'd the, uh, where'd the other guy go? The other guy just fucking dip? He died and ran away. <coughs> what the heck? There you are. <gasps> My baby. Just after you left, Lucinia asked me to go and catch up with you in case you need a hand. Someone must have that sip that I have a little experience in transporting barrels of ceruleum. 
so this is Tapas Den. Well then, after you. Was that cutscene all for that? All that just so oh, never mind, there's more. <gasps> a Hrothgar! A horny Hrothgar. Who are you? What up to the gods? Yes, go I beat their ass. The Eorzeans and Rebels here to save the people of Garlemald. Doesn't make any goddamn sense! Why in the hell would you pass up this chance to put those imperial bastards to the sword? Let me guess. None of you are Garlean. You were brought here from other lands. Girabanya, Yangsha, Bosia, Bo 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 I forgot Bosia, right? Dalmasca, to name but a few. Some dragged here against their will. Others fed bollocks about a better life or put to work extracting cerulean. All given the esteemed title of An, placing us firmly on the bottom rung of the ladder. The old hierarchy means nothing in the new Golem mold, says we. About the only thing that's escaped more or less on the scale is cerulea. Ingans, still sustaining us even with our paymasters of the picture. We hear your experts in drawing up cerulean from the bottom of the lake. But how can you do that if it's frozen over? Ha! Would you like to know? Trade secrets, I'm afraid. At any rate, it's not as if cerulean is used for much these days. With what, what with the city in ruins, we take enough to power our heater, save the surplus for later. <clears throat> and though it helps stave off the cold, it does sod all of our our hunger unless we can trade it away. <clears throat> I got a booger. I got like the nasal drip shit going on. It's like killing me. <clears throat> but I'll survive. Speaking of which, be sure to tell your contingent we've got cerulean by the barrelful. If they're interested, we'll exchange it for whatever provisions they're willing to spare. We can suddenly ask, but if you're all free to go now, why carry on living here? Free to go? Where? Even if we manage to get back to our homelands, there'd be nothing left for us next to the Empire. The knowledge and skills we acquired working here would be practically useless as our golem mold. So we're staying for the time being. Long as there's a need for Cerulean, we'll find a way to get by. Even if golem mold as we knew it is gone for good. Gone for good. Can you do an accent like Sid? Like Sid the Sloth? Um, uh, I, uh, gosh, I don't think I, I don't think I can do a Sid the Sloth voice. I can't do a Sid voice, unfortunately. I mean, I can, I, uh, if you gave me some time to like properly practice, maybe. <coughs> oh my God. Oh, the nasal drip. It's dripping. It's fucking dripping. I can't do it. A dandelion. A dand a dandelion. Like I can't do it. I don't know how to do it. Regardless of what the Ilsabad contingent does for the people of Garlemald, the Empire itself is already a thing of the past. For many, that would be a cause for celebration, while for others, a whole way of life will have been turned upside down. After all the atrocities committed in the Empire's name, perhaps it's for the best that it is consigned to history. But what of the ordinary people? The lives, the stories. Should they be forgotten too? Hmm. I suppose there'll be plenty of time to ponder that later. For now, let's see about getting some cerulean. Nice. I'm getting some items here. What am I getting? Pewter leg gear coffer. What is that? Is it ugly? Let's see. Wait, where is it? Wait, what was it called? The luncheon toad skin? Try on. Oh, actually, that's not as ugly as I thought it would be. It just looks like a recolor of um, one of the uh, the other armors. Ooh, wait. Ooh, wait. This looks kind of dope. It's like dragon scaly. I actually kind of fuck with that. Never thought I would say that I like quest armor, but this actually kind of bangs. It's pretty fucking good. I like it. I could definitely make like a good fit with that. Even just this, a little bit of like, 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 uh, like dragon scales beneath this. I kind of fuck with that. Okay, Pepper. At the end of the trail, Jarek is amenable to making a deal. 
So if you come seeking Cerulean, have you? Yes, got a boss up above. What? Those pure bloods up at Victor Spoil sent you? To turn to the enemies for help. They must be more desperate than I thought. And again, Latini has got her little sister thinking about. Oh, <gasps> so there was a voice. She's got a little sister. A sister? Well, I saw Latini and three men. It's possible she died from whatever was ailing her. If she needs treat, if she needed treatment, I doubt there'd be any way to get it around here. I may have refused Latinia at first. Latinia. I'm thinking she'd come back with something to exchange, but I can spare them a bottle's worth of ceruleum. Consider a reward for introducing me to the rest of your contingent. Be sure to send them my way. You hear? Oh, <gasps> it was that easy. Okay. I can't for the life of me think why Latinia would help her sister. Will keep her secret. Keep her sister a secret from us, but we can ask about that after we've delivered the ceruleum. Come on, let's hurry back. Honestly? Still really sus. I guess she doesn't like fully trust us, you know? <gasps> My bodyguards? Allons-y. Hmm. God, it's so... Okay, so that is obviously super ominous. <laughs> like, crazy ominous. But this area is honestly really pretty and the oh fuck my ass and the music is really good <laughs> ilsa bardian Tur tursus tursus <clears throat> oh yeah i can't fly here now let's arrive right jump nice easy easy peasy I'm excited to get Gunbreaker at 90. We're what? We're about a million away. 1.1 million away. That's just like, I think three more quest completions. I literally just got back as you said that. <gasps> Hello, Keys. Welcome back. Where'd you run off to? You abandoned me in my hour of need. Okay, let's see. Up, up, up. Up, 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 up. I love a good snowy location. I'm such a sucker for cold areas. I don't know what it is. If the area looks like it's permanently winter or permanently autumn, then I'm like, I'm all in. Oh, like, look at that. I do not like the sound of it, of the overgrown roses, like ooing and gooeying and being all you know, mac and cheese like. <laughs> but regardless, this area is fucking beautiful. I was eating up food, I wasn't far away. Good. Are you sharing with the class? You heard me, mac and cheese. They mac and cheesing it up. <clears throat> That's what good pussy sounds like. Those overgrown roses? I'm gonna start. <laughs> I'm not, okay, no, I'm not. I will not call my pussy an overgrown rose, but I may as well. <laughs> this isn't right. It's too quiet. I would have thought Alfie now would still be treating them by the fire, but they're nowhere to be seen. Oh, fuck. Look inside the house. Will you search outside? The cans have gone far. Oh, fuck. If anything happened to my sweet boy, chat? Chat, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous. I'm fucking nervous. Alfino better be okay. Those garlians. Oh. Sickly refugee. Oh shit. Oh shit. Did they get ambushed? Did the two die? Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fuck. And where's the girl? Where's Latinia? They asked me. They asked me to carry out to, to help carry supplies. When I followed them back here, they attacked me, caught me off guard, forced me to defend myself. I fear they fared rather worse than me. You can't fool us. We know. We know what you're about. Oh my god. Vultures. That's what you are. Waiting in the wings for us to show weakness. Then in you swoop. Here to help. What rot. All a ploy. To make us lower our guard. Let you in. Put ourselves at mercy. At your mercy. Put us in chains. Steal our lands. Get your revenge. We're literally trying to help you, brother. You're wrong. That's not what any of us want. 
We literally got the ceruleum. Save the arguments for later. We've got bigger problems. Oh shit. I found empty medicine bottles on a bed that was still warm. It's true. The genio was hiding a sick sister inside the house. And now there's no sign of either of them. Oh my god, they're on the run! Where are they? Where did they go? Away from you and yours. If you think I'll tell you, you're a fool. I'd never give you... I'd never give up my people. <clears throat> oh my god, my accent is like going in and out because I'm so like... Eh. My throat is all... Bleh, you know? <laughs> We're trying to help them, you idiot. Her sister's ill. The empty bottles prove it. So the medicine ran out or she put it in her pockets to make it easier to carry. <clears throat> or to avoid the sound of clinking glass. There are beasts everywhere. How could you let them go alone? To protect them from you. Oh my god, just kill this man already. Put him out of his misery. If you invade our homeland, tainted with the same sorcery used to slay our countrymen, a Kalyan should sooner die than suffer the insult. And better for them to flee, keep their purity intact, than be corrupted by your vile magics. We were waiting, waiting for a chance to free them since the moment you arrived. What? And here we were, thinking we were being the good guys, eh? Oh, this is getting us nowhere. I cannot say how Lucinia and her sister will react when we find them, but find them we must. Go on without me, both of you. I first need to attend to my injuries and theirs. I will join you in the search after. <clears throat> You're gonna heal them after that? <coughs> All right, be careful. I would have shown absolutely zero mercy. We'll do our best to find them quickly. Is this even worth it though? There's only one path out of here, so that's where we'll start. Damn, y'all are better than me. Y'all are definitely better than me. Chat, I am so cold. I am so fucking cold right now. I'm gonna go get a coat, okay? Give me one second. I need to, like, adjust the heat in my home. I'm, like, freezing. Holy shit. <clears throat> Don't look at my butt. Don't look at my Oh, I just stepped in, in my dog's uh, slobber. Holy shit. <clears throat> He's not a dark knight, my son. No. He, I mean, I guess, like, what do I expect, right? He's a sage. Of course he's going to, like, want to heal. Oh, my God. Am I losing my voice? Chat, whoa. <coughs> Holy shit. I think I'm losing my voice. Whoa. Chat, what just happened? Maybe it's all the... Um, <clears throat> All the phlegm in my throat. Do I sound different? I do, right? Suddenly, I don't sound the same. The Uniqlo represent? Absolutely. I'm cold as shit, baby. I'm trying to warm the fuck up. Ooh. <clears throat> Gotta be nice and toasty. Hydrate? I am. I am. 
You sound a bit gravelly. I do sound a bit gravelly. It's kind of hot though, right? You like how I sound? Got by the pizza mafia after Lizinia incident. Oh my god, I got got. That's the last time I mock Italians. Mamma mia. Pepperoni. Prosciutto. It's a me, a Mario. <coughs> okay. All right. We're good though. Yeah, there's like a little rasp to my uh to my voice now. It's kind of hot though. Like I'm not really gonna complain. I wish I sounded, you know. I wish I had a sexier voice. You know. I feel like I don't. All right. Are we good? Are we good to carry on? <coughs> Holy shit. <coughs> I think we're good now. All right, speak with Alize. All right, where's my babes? Where's my sweet girl? So we're actually gonna go and find the girl and her sister. I mean, we did get the cerulean for them. I guess we may as well like complete the mission, right? She looks kind of hopeless. So did we find more footprints? Or are those her footprints? No, nope. those are definitely two pairs of footprints. Two sets of fresh footprints. Young woman, judging by the size. This is definitely them. Come on. <sighs> I don't know if this is a good idea. Like, personally, I would not go after them. You know what I mean? Like, I wouldn't. Not that I would let them die, but it's like they clearly don't want our help. They don't trust us. And they've tried... They just tried killing Alfino, you know, and thankfully he's strong and can heal, so he didn't die. But we could have just come back to a dead Alfino, you know. You know? I guess uh, I guess the Scions and all them are way better people than I'll ever be. The trail stops at the frozen lake. Perhaps they chose this route as so as to not leave footprints. I can't think of any other reason. Look at this place, it's crawling with beasts. And I can only imagine how hard it must be for her ailing sister to cross the ice. We could really do with Alfino's help, but we can't afford to wait for him. Let's put up and look for clues. <sighs> oh my god, uh, this is huge! All right. <clears throat> Damn, at the end of the trail. I love how that's the end of this, uh, or the, the title of this quest. It's a little bit foreboding. Oh, I think we found a clue. It's gonna be like a hole. Is that one footprint? Oh, it's a piece of paper. Half buried piece of paper. The wet paper half buried in the snow appears to be a flyer for a theater group. Though the run of shows advertised has long since ended. I don't think that's, that's a good, uh, that's a good clue. I just heard a mount. Oh, hello, Rizzy. Oh my God, wait, I have one of those too. Oh, wrong one, wrong one. Actually, I have that, fuck, I have that exact one, but I use this guy because it looks like my dog. <laughs> the one you're using is 10 out of 10. Okay. What's that? Oh, it's another enemy. Ooh, look at the wintry tree. Oh my god, the ends look so cool. Fuck, I forgot what they're called. What are these things called again? What are you? What are you called? What are you called? Oh, you're called an Agar Agaris. Agaris? <sighs> okay, anyway, let's go check out this clue. <gasps> Is that a... Oh my god, it's blood! I thought that was a feather! Oh, it's fresh blood. Oh shit, they're dead as fuck. The blood saying the snow appears to be fresh. Judging by the amount, the victim may have been severely wounded. Should blood lead southeastwards. This way. Oh shit. This is getting ominous. Am I about to find two dead women? Am I gonna find Lucinia? Be like, oh, I should have trusted you. I should have gotten your help. Okay, I see. Is that guts? Is that guts chilling in the distance? Yeah. But what is all this? Oh, the little tree sprouts. 
There's definitely going to be a quest related to this area. Ooh. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Where am I going? Am I going this way? Oh, fuck. They're both dead. Oh, shit. Oh, and they died holding hands. Oh, wait. Oh, this is so sad. But what killed them? The beasts? Aiding. Is she alive? Is she breathing? Oh shit. Is she breathing? Ugh, the two bodies are already cold. Yeah, well, they're in the snow. <laughs> Sorry, maybe I shouldn't joke about them being dead. Radio. <laughs> oh, we know it's catching up. Blood trail. We found one. They were attacked. This is so ominous. No. Oh, do you think they... Oh, they weren't attacked. Did they... You don't think... So they would rather Safer to brave die the wilds than, than trust tr in our magic. We should have. I should have. <coughs> well, fucking shit. <coughs> Fuck. We can't sorry, we're like this. We have to take them home. What if we're only making it worse? Maybe we don't belong here, but neither do they. Not out here in the wind and the cold. the story about Varus's voice from beyond the grave. Of course, I didn't believe it, but Lacinia and her sister did. Oh, it's Lacinia. Perhaps there is something to the tale no, after all. That's Lacinia. <laughs> I want to understand, so I'm going to borrow this for a while, if that's all right. You had every reason not to trust us. We came as trespassers, invaders. But I pray that in time, we will be more than that to you. That we will find a way to help your loved ones. And see that no more children are left to freeze alone in the snow. Thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the coven. I hope you enjoy your badger most and your stay. 
Damn. <sighs> Andy, thank you for the 14 months. Thank you. I'm making sure they're nice and clean. No, respectfully, keep them clean. Keep it to whom clean. Man. That was fucking grim. I don't even know, like, how to react in a way i saw it coming but i also didn't you know like them leaving like running away i suspected something bad would happen like there's no way that could have led to anything good and for them like they would rather kill themselves and literally face the beast in this cold, cold, cold climate that they're not even, like, well-suited for, then even trust us, like, after what we just did, like, to go and literally get them the, like, the ceruleum they needed and all that shit, like, yeah, that's fucking bleak, but I guess that's, like, life. That's, that's life. That level of fear and paranoia is just suffocating? Yeah. I can't imagine, like, well, I mean, not to that extreme, but, like, I I get it, you know? But to be that traumatized and unable to, to even have, like, a glimmer of, of, you know, what if -isms or whatever, that's so sad. Damn. Damn, chat, what the fuck? <coughs> And Walker got hands, bro. And Walker got hands. Let me talk to Alfie now again. Yeah, yeah. I guess I don't know what I expected. The music that was playing during that cutscene, it does such a good job helping bring out the waterworks and throughout the whole expansion. It's just downright masterful. It's gonna fuck me in the ass. Raw. And I'm not looking forward to it. I am not looking forward to it. I'm scared. That song is gonna make me cry. It's going to make me cry. It's going to break me. Omni, hello. There must have been something we could have done. But what? Should we have never come here? Would they, be, would they still be alive if we hadn't? No, they probably would have froze to death. And there's no point thinking about that either, you know? Hey, one, two, three, four, Gil. <sighs> All right, let's speak with the Alfie now now. Away from oh my god, okay, 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 okay. My heart just stopped for a second because from this angle, I thought that was Orishi for a second. I know the hair color isn't right, but I oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is gonna be a long X pack. This is gonna be a long fucking X pack. <sighs> You're breathtaking too, Omni. <coughs> Alfina's resolve may be shaken, but he has not forgotten his duty. We have already caused enough harm here. Let's return to the camp before we have caused before we cause any more. As for those inside the house, we should send them we should send someone to take care of them. Someone who isn't us. All we can do for now is make a report to Lucia and do everything in our power to prevent further tragedy. So let's linger here no more. Come. Do, 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 do. Yo, y'all crying too? Because that was fucking brutal. Alright, let's get some camp broken glass. Damn, that really set the tone for the rest of Endwalker, eh? And to think I am still only on the level 82 quest. Like, we have a long way to go. We just keep a walk until we get to the end. We got a long way to go, baby. You got your mount? Yay! Congrats, Emmy. The writing team took Galamond areas and what happened in the fall of Nazi party? What is Galamond? But I see what you mean. I see what you're talking about. I thought the twins had gotten taller than I realized Peppermint is shorter than my warrior blade. Peppermint is baby! Pepper is 
was just a wee gal, okay? It's no use taking all these garlands if we're going to let them freeze to death. We need heat, for goodness sake. I knew I should have brought more warming tinctures. Oh. <coughs> oh, you mean garland mold? Yeah, yeah. No, I, I do see, I do see what you mean. There are a lot of um, very realistic, real-world references um, here. I mean, like you know, themes of invasion. Tr and, like the trauma that comes with with that with like oh my god let me let me start that over the trauma that comes with invasions and war is it's very cookie cutter um and i see a lot of it referenced in not referenced but i see a lot of real world um events like loosely referenced trauma from real world events like Lucy referenced in this game and um that's why some of these missions like hit hard because you're like oh that makes sense or like oh my folks went through that or oh I've went through that you know it's crazy it's like it's fucking crazy the machinists reckon old in Syria Heaton Heaton was just left there consuming ceruleum so there was none left. He even put sat on stoves, all the food inside burned to soot. In any case, even if we had plenty of fuel, it's the magic tech itself that's bugging. We'll have to either look for spare parts or make them ourselves. Yo, this Ellison is fine. <coughs> Pray give me a moment to finish up designs of the ceruleum heater. I shall have it ready before you know it. Truth be told, I've already warmed up after a much heated debate with a Leminson engineer. But mercy, you managed to make an important discovery in the process. Lit. Is there anyone else I could chat with? Ooh, one of these days, chat? I'm just gonna stream a bunch of the side quests. I think that'll be fun. <coughs> Would y'all be interested? Just a bunch of side questing? Because we have a ton that we can do here, you know? Is that Sadu? I have been looking for you! Setting atop an enormous edifice to cast their eyes down upon the Dominion. These Lothroy and, and the Orinir have much in common. That even Magna and his ilk would not stoop to stealing the minds of their subjects and enemies. When the time comes to storm the stronghold, I shall lead the charge and leave not for ash in my wake. Slay mama. Magna is kind of fucked, but he's hot as hell. You know? I'll let him hit. I would let him hit. Bro, my poor neck. <gasps> Hi, real. Searching for survivors. <laughs> they are truly strong. If they are truly strong, they will not require our aid. While you are gone, we will guard the camp against any man or beast foolish enough to challenge us. My duty as sentinel will afford me little opportunity to seek my my Nama. I don't remember how to pronounce that. I don't even remember what that was. <laughs> Fuck, what's Nama again? I'm asking for some hot chocolate chat. Give me some hot chalky. His boo thing? His boo thing? He has a boo thing? I thought he was like down horrendously single. Oh, his future wife. Oh, is that what it was called? Like whoever it, 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 it was like that he'd mate with or whatever the hell? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Though perhaps one among our ranks come bearing a hot meal is such for proof worthy. Oh God. What's that sound? Was that you, Rissy? Also, hello. Hello. I give kiss. I give smoochy smooch. Little smoochy smooch. Oh my god, look at those thighs. Look at those thighs. I'm so fucking unworthy. Oh. Viera mommies are just so. Oh. Is she mounting me? Oh. <gasps> well. Your mount is very fucking pretty. Look at all those sparkles! God damn! It's like stardust! Beauty. Alright. I must go back to my quest. Magnite would be bottoming? I believe it. I feel like he's... Oh, actually, no. He's definitely not a power bottom. He seems like a brat. He just seems like a fucking brat. Oh, that's the new mount? Let's wait. Let me see it again. Oh! Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. We're all good. <laughs> Don't worry about it. 
All right, let's speak with everyone here. <coughs> Treatment of the tempered is proceeding as well as can be expected. If there's anything to report, you will be sure to know. Though I gather you have a report of your own to deliver. Let's chat with Maxima. Forgive me for saying, but the three of you appear rather drained since your return. So what I might do have to be of assistance. All right, let's speak with Lucia. I need to know if anyone told me they have finished the preliminary search for survivors, but refrain from saying much more than that. Clearly, they are reluctant to provide details. Might I ask for your account? Yeah, I, uh, I got you. Thank you for your report. We shall inform the troops of these developments and instruct them to proceed with the utmost caution should they encounter any survivors. Allow me to go and speak with the ones at the Victor's Spoils. They may be more willing to listen to a fellow Garlean than accept our offer of assistance. Mm. I pray you are right. And though I am loath to burden you any further, should there be an appropriate occasion to speak of Lacinia and her sister, please do so. I am sorry to have put you through this. My distress is nothing compared to their suffering. So tell me, what else have we learned? As you may have already heard, we have <laughs> succeeded in curing the members of the Popularis, Maxima identified. Slay. They have provided us with some intriguing insights into the current state of Garlemald. The assassination of Emperor Varus was the catalyst for the civil war. Nerva declared his claim to the throne, and his opponents refused to recognize it. Fighting broke out in the capital, where Nerva's third legion clashed with the first, who remained loyal to Varus even after his death. Of course, even Imperial warmongers would balk at the idea of turning their shining city into a battleground. Like burning down the wood to spite the wasps. Neither side would be so mad. Unless Jesus. something or someone inflamed their animosity to such an extent that they could not help but act against their better judgment. Oh my god! Flashbanging! It brings to mind events of the Gimlet Dark, does it not? The Emperor's sudden withdrawal from the front line, specifically. Mm. Nerva and his father, Titus, Varus's then political rival, took advantage of rumors that Crown Prince Zenos had been possessed by a demon. Motherfucking Ashley Tisdale, bro. What better way to disparage Elder Bussy? Try or a close enough approximation. Indeed, but before their accusations could be substantiated, many of Titus's followers were silenced. Uh, while some were merely stripped of their status, others died under curious circumstances, one after another, suddenly and suspiciously. Again, Elidibus. Like as not, he had a hand in it. No evidence was found to implicate Varus, certainly. Nevertheless, Titus, Nerva, and the Third Legion would have judged it a brazen attempt by the Emperor to rid himself of his political enemies. And then, in the midst of this growing turmoil, Varus Soskalvis is murdered. Oh my goodness. And Garlemald's own prodigal son, Gaius van Belsar, is named the murderer. Shortly thereafter, Nerva claims the right of succession, and in response, the First Legion claims the assassination was part of a coup d'etat orchestrated by Titus and Nerva. So no one is at fault, and everyone else is to blame. I should add that both parties received substantial financial backing, <coughs> presumably to provide them with the means and encouragement to pursue a swift victory. And that these contributions came from the self-same benefactor. 
I'd heard House Brutus had been filling the Third Legion's coffers, but the first as well. It would seem so. Though the Popularis determined that the First Legion received funds from a variety of organizations, all had connections to House Brutus. So Fandaniel, in the guise of Arsahi, was playing both sides against each other the entire time. The information we gained from my friends does not end there. One night, shortly after fighting broke out, the capital was shaken by an immense tremor. From that point onward, they have no memories, no recollection of any events, including our clash on the Magna Glacius. Glacius, that's But when asked Glacius. about the Imperial Palace and its bizarre transformation, they somehow recall Emperor Varus giving them orders in their dreams. Oh, that's what they were talking about. May the about. Tower of Babel stand as testament the to Tower the glory of Tower of Babel? God. This sounds awfully familiar. We have something to show you all. The radio? Mm. Varys spoke to them through this radio. Perhaps it was a recording, but if not, that would be inexplicable. How do you see? How do you see, bro? We are of one mind, then. You need a headband. <gasps> oh, the little doohickeys. The ether that permeates the ore used in this device is almost identical to that of the talismans. I see it. <laughs> While it is likely more by coincidence than design, these devices might also ward against a primal's influence. A picture is beginning to form. If the tremor felt throughout Garlemald was a wave of ether emitted by a primal, then while those within range would have been tempered, those huddled around a radio desperate for news concerning the Civil War would have been spared. No wonder Licinia kept it close. My friends, I must speak with you. Are we being ambushed? Are we being attacked? What's going on? What do y'all see? A man was caught trying to steal our supplies. He is a soldier of the Iron Men, we think, but one who has not been made thrall. Thankfully, Magni restrained him before <coughs> blood was spilled. The stranger is outside, if you wish to ask him questions. I think we do. Who do we have here? The person who gave me a heart attack. Garleans? Traitors to your homeland! Have you no shame? I am Lucia Junius. A temple knight of Ishgard. And you are? Julius Pier Norbanus. And that's all you invaders will get from me. We are not here to invade Garlemald. Far from it. Like you, our allies in Eorzea and the Far East fight in defense of their lives and their loved ones even as we speak. But it is the people of Garlemald who have suffered most. This we know. And that is why we have come to offer you our aid, that we may unite against our common foe. Whether you believe me or not, those are the facts. Now, answer me this. Why would a proud soldier of the Empire be reduced to stealing? The situation must be dire indeed for you to go to such lengths. <clears throat> if it is supplies you seek, we would gladly share ours, or turn a blind eye while you leave with your spoils. 
I will not negotiate. My commander will determine how to deal with you and yours. You've got a commander? If you wish to treat with him, I will take you, but no more than three. Is he hot? I got priorities. I don't much like the sound of <clears throat> that. But if we do accept his proposal, I suggest the two of us and... Please allow me and Alize to act as envoys. May I ask why? We have seen with our own eyes the hardships the Garleans face. How their futures and lives hang in the balance. It's not the warmest invitation, but it's an opportunity to prove our intentions true. Maybe not a chance to make things right, but a chance to make them better. I love my babies so fucking much. I love my babies so much, chat. Oh, they have the biggest, warmest, sweetest, softest of hearts. <laughs> and wish nothing but the best. Anna, hello. Yes, we are back to Final Fantasy XIV shenanigans. Hi, Urban Serpent. Do you think Abraham Lincoln is hot? What? What? Abraham Lincoln? What are you talking about? Hi, Jengates. Hello. I am well, this quest line is very fucking depressing, but it is pretty good so far. What is go? Hi, it's nice to see you. Hello, hello. Hello, Eternal. Yes, welcome, welcome. We are still live. We'll be live for a little bit longer. You know how I am with this game? You know how I am with this fucking game? King, hello. Welcome in. Hi, Red. Hello. Hello, friends. Sorry. I was so, I was so enthralled. I was a thrall. I could not, like, I, whenever the cutscenes are going on and there's, like, stuff happening in the game, it's so difficult for me to, like, peer away. I'm so just, like, entranced. I'm so sorry. Peppermint is always doing shenanigans. You're right. The twins are forever the babiest of babies or collective children. I know. I would genuinely do anything for them. I want to work them into Pepper's lore so fucking badly. Bro, Final Fantasy XIV is the game that made me makes me interested in fi fantasy politics. Yo, <coughs> Game of Thrones and Lord of the Rings did that for me. Even the Lord of the Rings politics are very loose. Um, game of Thrones fantasy politics are fucking fire. Fire. First day I go to work last week was raining in Toronto. Had to walk in the rain. And what's wrong with that? Toronto in the rain is beautiful. I hope you're enjoying it, by the way. A good chunk of us that experienced the thrill of the... Oh, wait. You're fine, Sarah. A good chunk of us that experienced the thrill of the story. Hope you're enjoying it so far. I am enjoying it. Thank you for understanding. I just sat down. What I miss? Everything, Red. Every fucking thing. I'm going with you. What would your mother say if I let you two go by yourselves? I'm going with you. I can see that persuading you otherwise is a lost cause, but you will proceed with the utmost care. How did I just notice Lucia has like a blonde streak in her hair? Couple of children and what? A cell sword? Is this an insult? Eulis, shut the fuck up. Not in the least. You will find that they are more than qualified to speak on our behalf. Mm-hmm. Pepper is a Miko of there many words. There are many words. dangers on the road ahead. I will need that back. When the fuck did Magnite put this outfit on? I literally just spoke to him and he was in a coat. What the fuck? <coughs> oh, that wasn't. Oh, oh, that wasn't Magnite. Oh, my bad, bro. Oh, y'all kind of. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, you're blue and you're not. Oh, my bad, bro. My bad. <laughs> Yo, I'm almost as tall as this dude and he wants to fucking start beef. The audacity, the fucking gall, bro. 
Perhaps it is unwise to volunteer for a mission so soon after the previous disaster. <laughs> Nevertheless, I shall not squall on this opportunity. <clears throat> I know, I know, so I'm reckless. This won't bring back Latinia or her sister. Taking the same risks, making the same mistakes, it's possible. But better to try than to give up. Every time. Hold on, Guts, I, I, I see you head pat me, but I don't see you. Where did you head pat me, bro? <laughs> All right. <coughs> oh my God. <coughs> Talk about fucking jump scare. Oh my God, and I'm getting slapped? No! Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? This man just spawns in front of me, smacks me, and leaves. Nah, my hu I'm getting a divorce. I'm getting a fucking divorce. <laughs> no, it was not racially motivated. Leave me alone. Look up. Oh, shit. Oh, hey. Look, you, you told me to look up, and I think I just looked up this person's pants. I did. Oh, my God. Are those balls? Wait. I don't like that. I don't like the way that looks. I don't. Uh, I don't. I don't. You know. <laughs> this is very. The graphics here are very unfortunate. A homeboy is not even a camel toe. This is a fucking bamel toe, a bussy toe. Like. Bro, you got bigger problems to worry about. God damn. Holy shit. Thank you, Square Enix. <gasps> Welcome back. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> All right, let's speak with Lucia. <coughs> you, will you will be received as invited guests, so I urge you to observe proper social etiquette and conduct yourselves accordingly. Oh! <gasps> Wait. Wait. Oh my god, Saren, hello! The Jul the Ulysses. The Ulysses is not something I've ever wanted to see, but alas, thanks to Guts, we've seen it. <coughs> I need to get a lozenge chat. All this talking is like drying up my throat. He kind of low-key thick, but I can't let a garland colonize my body. <laughs> Don't stoop that low, bestie. Sumi, you could do better. Unfortunate news. I've misplaced my, my uh, good lozenges, but must do what I must do. All right. Am I good? Thanks, my mama. Stay strong and stay focused, you know? That's what I like to hear. Oh. Mark, how are you? Look at you sitting all comfy like. Oh, fuck me. You know what's crazy? When I play other games, I get tired very quickly. But when I play this game, I just don't. I just don't get tired playing Final Fantasy XIV. Like, I could play it literally all day. All day, and I just don't burn out. I mean, I do burn out, but, like, not as quickly, you know? Always comfy when watching Final Fantasy XIV streams. They are fun to watch. 
I watch them a ton too. Obviously, like the ones that I can partake in. But like, man. <coughs> Obligatory event reminder. Oh, when does that end? By the way. Fueled by headpads. Headpads are the biggest motivator for anything, especially for me. Final Fantasy XIV feels like an extension of self to me. What makes you feel that way? I see the cry counter is up to 67. Was the bump from 66 the walk the other day listening to music or something that happened on stream? Something that happened on stream. Um, our good old friend Orshikon Greystone came to pay a visit. And unfortunately, the visit didn't make me cry per se, but I uh, was looking at his model for a little too long. And it reminded me that, you know, I haven't seen Orshafon's model in game in a really long time. And it made me really sad because I'm never going to see it again unless I play a new file. And... Um, So it just made me sad. What about New Game Plus? Or New Game Plus? Or New Game Plus? Yeah. If you know, don't, even if you don't see him, our old friend is always with us in our hearts. I know. I know. You guys are making me want to pull out my fr like my framed photo of him. Like, whenever I'm sad, it really leaves a hole in the chest, bro. That is not okay. That is not okay. That is not okay, Red! Who do you think you are? You come into my stream and break my heart. What the fuck? I go to his grave in the game every few weeks, man. For about like a month or two, I would log off at his grave all the time. And sometimes I would just let my character idle there. I gotta go catch up with him soon. I gotta tell him about my adventures. A safe return takes precedence above all else. Remember this, I will. Thancred in particular will be worried sick if you're gone too long. Oh, may the fury watch over and keep you. Thancrissy is gonna be worried about me? Oh my god, Janae, hello! Damn, look at them boombies. Goddamn, mama. Goddamn, goddamn. Goddamn, goddamn. Hello. <laughs> I'm doing my Esther travel, Esther visa for the States, and they need to know my Twitter at. Wait, why do they need your Twitter at? <laughs> what the fuck? I really hope the US government likes that my Twitter name is MILF Carnage. Oh, you're an icon. <laughs> Had to come give you headfest to celebrate your return. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet of you. I appreciate that so much. I just kissed your pussy. I hope you're okay with that. <laughs> Are you and the children ready? Oh, I'm gonna stomp this kid's head. I will explain the route once we are outside your camp. If anyone attempts to follow us, we will judge it an act of hostility. We will not hesitate to take appropriate measures. I'd expect nothing less. You have, oh, I would expect nothing less. You have a full cooperation. Bye! Hey, where am I going? Oh, I'm going this way. Now, now, now. Oh, 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 mommy is logged on. Mommy has logged on. Wait, wait, FC mommy has logged on. All right, fingers crossed. <laughs> Okay, hopefully I get mommy back now. Wait, who the? For a second, I thought that was Vosk. I was like, why is this your name up there? 
Oh my god, am I mommy now? It doesn't say I got I got boosted to mommy. Oh, I was elected mommy. Mommy's back. Fuck yeah. Do you play this off stream such as going for crafting and gathering leveling up? I used to. I haven't done that in a hot, 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 hot minute. I used to play FF14 offline a lot. I did I did lots I did a, I did most of my leveling off uh, off stream. And I plan on continuing that. Actually no, I think I might do more more leveling on stream, honestly. <gasps> Anna! Hello, bestie. Alright, let's go speak with Euless. I think they make it made it mandatory to know Facebook, LinkedIn, Insta, and Twitter for some fucking reason. That feels like a huge invasion of privacy. I kinda hate that, honestly. <coughs> Alright, this is far enough. Listen carefully. We head over the hill and then follow the road until we reach Liminal Station 4? Is that the number 4? Children lead. I want you where I can see you. Oh my god. We do have names, you know. I'm Alize and he's Alfie you now. And last but not least, there's Pepper. Pepper. Where have I heard that before? No matter. Alfino you know, and Alize will watch the road ahead while we bring up the rear. Ooh, bring up the rear with me? I don't know what that was. I don't know what that was. I don't want to hear it. I did not go into the mic, okay? I've never done that before in my entire life, and I'm never going to do it again. I wasn't lying about there being many dangers, so you to run, not Santa, run towards the station. If you ever think about, if you even think about going for your weapon, the deal, then the deal's off. Should any creatures bar the way, we go around them. Once you choose to depart, Duelist will accompany you. Alfino and Alize will then begin moving towards the destination. Make your way to the little station 4 without falling behind. If you leave Yulis behind for any reason or lose sight of Alfino and Alize, you may try again. But oh my god, not one of these. Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. We're running, running, and running, running, and I am faster than them. I am faster than them. Da 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 da. Damn, we're really staying in staying in order. Oh my god, he's like tailing me. God damn. Okay. Okay, so maybe sprinting was not the move. I just have to run at like the normal speed, like speed. <laughs> <laughs> Very rare XD of you. Once you get caught up on story, less chance of accidentally seeing spoilers around that way. I really haven't seen many spoilers. I don't get many things ruined for me for uh, with this game, which is really nice. I do hope to gain your trust like a genuine game for helping out in your leveling. Aw! You don't need to gain my trust. You could just come hang out and level with me. Easy peasy. Why would you say that? I know I'm probably jinxing it, but we have been pretty lucky. That's the station, I presume. Yeah, it looks like one. This big dude better not attack us. Mm-mm. Oh, we're chilling. Look at us. We have a new mod. Let me talk about how not shitty people are nonstop. <gasps> There's Vosk. Kelly Sire just let me shivering left me shivering the coal on the side of the road. Hey, look, I can't rescue everybody, okay? I saved my heels for Vosk when they died. I'm sorry though, Anna. I'm sorry though. I'm such a terrible healer. This is why I'm a tank, okay? This is why I'm a tank and not a healer. Love me! Love me! Also, wait, I saw Elle was in here. Are they still here? Elle, are you still here? Hold on. I want to give Elle a little, a little badge if Elle is in here. There we go. <coughs> hey, don't air quotes, tank! I'm a good tank. Sometimes. I appreciate your sacrifice on my behalf. Anything for you, bestie. <laughs> This is it. The first stop, that is. I love his coat. Like, dead ass. I want it. Good. Looks like your friends knew better than to follow us. Are these your headquarters? No. I'm stopping here so I can check for pursuers. Since it appears you've kept to your side of the bargain, you can carry on. It was that easy, huh? 
North of the station is Regio Demorum, one of the main residential areas. Well, at least it was. The afflicted roam the streets in packs. They'll tear us to shreds if given the chance. Keep close. No wandering off. Understood? The last bastion. I hate Overwatch. <laughs> oh, we got shoes. Oh my god, look, I am literally 100k XP away from leveling up. Just 100k. I'm back for the most part. I got my sponges and brushes washed and I got the laminated, laminated prints for my friend. Main thing now is to just get my wagon stacked with stuff packed back in my roller cart. I believe in you. I believe in you, Kelsey. Just a bee's dick away. A bee... You know what? You're right. Just a bee's dick away indeed. I've never heard that before, but I love it. I'll train you when you want it. Oh, hello? A Dark Knight trainer? Frey is rolling in their grave. <clears throat> We're watching Stinky. We're watching you do be stinky, and that's why I'm going to the grand finals. <laughs> Your list knows only too well that danger looks around every corner. From here, we'll be heading northeast, keeping to the left of the railway. <gasps> Hi, puppy! Well, the route itself is straightforward. Getting past the hordes unseen is anything but. Keep your weapons at the ready. They would attack their own countrymen. Aye, they spare their own, but slot to the rest without hesitation. So we'll try to avoid detection. The chances of sneaking by completely unnoticed are slim at best. I will lead the way. In the event we are seen, we have to fight them off. Those two will... Those two will follow us, provided they can refrain from drawing their weapons. While I doubt they would be foolish enough to stab their guide in the back, I will not take the ch that chance. With that said, let us proceed. <clears throat> okay. Who is this? Who is this Uriange looking ass person? Moon Shadow? Sarine? Is it pronounced Sarine? Wait, you're hot as fuck! Damn. Damn. Yo, that shield! That shield is beautiful! Look at it! Okay, final sold out and 40 past too expensive? Yeah. I'm going on the Saturday. The Saturday tickets are still available. We should come with. Oh, this is you, King! Is it pronounced Sarine? Am I pronouncing that correctly? Hello! I sent friend request. Ellison are hot until they start walking and running. Not nice. Saturday, huh? Yeah! If you get a Saturday ticket, perhaps we could meet. What next? Paladin or warrior? Probably warrior. That's what I want to learn for sure. Okay, which way do I go? This way, okay. Tick, 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 tick. That would involve going outside my room. Okay, T. T, oh. Oh, there's beef. There is actual beef. Oh my god, this one. Celery? That ability is called celery? What did it do? Why did he use celery on me? Damn. <laughs> There's only one body left. Disappear now. Thank you. I see why your comrades chose you. Euless, a contingent has a cure for the afflicted, or tempered as we call them. Your people would need to be taken into custody that we may administer the treatment. They would eventually regain their sanity. 
Is that so? For all I know, your treatment would simply force them to forsake one master for another. As far as I and my legion are concerned, they are no longer our people. They're beyond saving. Those who thought differently and tried to reason with them were butchered for their bleeding hearts. Come, we have to keep moving. Okay, where are we going? Still this way? Let's see. Ooh, we're getting closer to this uh, ether, right? I think I'm gonna be able to attune. Can we get some attunage tonight? Let's see. Is that a tank? Is this a tank that got like turned over? Or it's a tr oh, it's a big ass fucking train. The runaway train. Okay, let's cut through here. Oh, perfect. Another enemy. Two more enemies. I go pew pew and I do a little jumpy jump. I do a little spinny spin. Look at me go. Look at me go. <laughs> Slay. Looks like we're not being followed. We'll continue onward. Oh, I'm so close to level 90. I can practically taste it, chat. Like, oh, that's what I'm most excited about right now. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, they killed these ones on their own, unless they were already dead. I meant what I said. These people deserve only death. I stayed my hand before only out of a desire to remain undiscovered. That is still the higher priority. 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 There's still the higher priority. We should continue to avoid any unnecessary confrontations. Keep following the railway. Will do, bestie. We're in north now? Yeah. That <laughs> blue DPS. That is literally me when I play Gunbreaker. <gasps> Russ, thank you for the raid. Hello, hello. Good timing. I literally just looked at my screen. Yo, 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 yo. <sighs> Ponto's in here? You got fucking Ponto in this raid? Fucking weird. What's up? Hello! Welcome, friends! My name is Syra. I am a Final Fantasy XIV streamer, and we are finally returning to Final Fantasy XIV. I took like a four month hiatus from this game because, like, it just overwhelmed me, and I just needed a fucking break, you know? I just needed to take a breather. And yeah, hi! I know, I'm playing Gunbreaker right now, but I'm actually not a Gunbreaker main. I'm a Dark Knight main, but my Gunbreaker is... Li look at this! Do you see this, chat? Do you see this? I am level 89. I am less than 100k XP from 90. I gotta get it. I gotta get there. I'm a new gay... I'm a new... <laughs> I'm a new gay. I'm a new guy to the game, and it's insane. Oh, wait! This is spoiler content, bro. Where are you at in the game? Did you just start? Are you new? You're in a realm reborn? Oh my god. Do not look. Do not look at my game. This is, uh, you are in mega, mega spoiler territory, my friend. He's a baby. Don't worry, I scrolled down. Very good, very good. Wow, so you can't even look at me. You're just hearing the sound of my beautiful voice. Stuck in a realm reborn for three more months. So the story goes. I think I was stuck in a realm reborn for literally like almost as long, actually. Syra ASMR. Yeah, you want my you want my poorly done British ASMR? I can provide that for you. If you can't look at my, you know, critically acclaimed Endwalker gameplay, the least I could do is whisper into your ears in my cheeky little accent. It's not really good, but I've got you. <laughs> Russ will be there until the next expansion comes out. Yeah, that's understandable. I've literally been an Endwalker for like five months. I think I started it in April. So actually like almost longer, almost six months. So it'd be like that. Ugh. 
But yeah, welcome friends. How is your night going? Is everyone just like settling down for the evening? Oh man. Just do a fade in that place with the alchemist and you'll get about 200k XP pretty easy. I'll be done this quest soon though, so it's okay. Oh. What are these guys? What is this? Oh, this is what the Imperials look like when they're fucking tempered? Now hold on. Yo, they got tentacles! Wait, it's kind of lit! Die, 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 die. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I do love that Yulis, Alfino, and Alize aren't doing anything. Like, it's literally just me against these guys. It's me against the world while they just stand there. Look at what they've become. You still stand there and claim that they can be cured. Those exposed to a vast quantity of primals ether may suffer severe corruption. Even with treatment, such victims are beyond salvation. Then you admit it. Now that you have seen these monstrosities for yourself, perhaps you will think twice before speaking of a cure. Okay, but it's possible, okay? Those guys are like far gone. Wait, let me attune. There's an ether right here somewhere. I see it on the map, but I don't like, I don't see it. Uh, is it behind this? Is it the top of this? Where is it? Is this where I'm going? Kind of. Oh, this place looks so run down. Oh, I'm obsessed. Where is, is it underground? I think it's underground. It's got to be in this rock here. I don't know how to get to it. Fuck. All right, whatever. Let's go this way. We're not done this quest yet, but I'm assuming they're going to take me underground so I can unlock that ether. I think. I'm almost there. You've kept your side of the agreement, so I'll keep mine. This way. Alright, where are we going? You gonna take me to the pits of fucking hell? <gasps> Thank you for the attunement. Yes! I love collecting attuners. <laughs> Not the smiles. I'm right! This is Tertium, one of Gollumall's larger stations, and that serves as our headquarters. I've already sent the twins ahead. I'll be with you soon. So wait for me at the bottom of the stairs. <gasps> running, running, and running, running, and running, running. Anna! Anna, are you dead here? Anna, do you need me? Oh, shit. Oh, is that a dead Garlean? <laughs> wait. They're kind of hot. Oh, they're not dead. They're alive. Still alive, but barely breathing. Are they going to be okay? Oh, dot dot dot. She clearly has no intention of speaking with you. All right, fuck you too, bro. I was gonna help, but all right. Anna, you got this covered? Yeah? It's cold? Here, I'll give you, I'll give you a nice little warm hug. Maybe that'll, maybe that'll warm you up. <laughs> I must go though. Must go onward. Is this another person that's cold and dying? Are they hot too? I, I don't know. Are they crying? Oh no, I'm hearing a radio. <coughs> I think that's what I'm hearing. Yo! Whoa! It's like a fucking bunker down here. It's kind of crazy. It's plain to see why they chose this as their base of operations. They could have done a lot worse. Even so, I imagine it's not the easiest place to live. Indeed, and if Yulis was willing to make the perilous journey to Camp Broken Glass in search of food, then supplies must be all but exhausted. They may be shielded from the wind and snow, but it's still bitterly cold. Much like Victor's spoils, it must be a constant struggle to keep the people warm. Lower your voices. While you may be here as my guest, the others will not take kindly to your presence. My command is in the locomotive over there. Mm 
But are they hot though? I got priorities. I like how the cutscene shows Pepper walking off, but like she definitely didn't. Oh, are we all just... Union Station sure has seen better days. Not fucking Union Station. Bosk, are you dead? Do you need some, do you need some warmth too? Do you need some food? Not like this. Not like this. Y'all fucking Broody McBrudersons over here. look like a lion Loki look like a lion but like not in a Hrothgar way just in these like are a their sexy chosen representatives a sexy way very well let us hear what they have to say yes sir I present to you our commander, Lord Quintus Van Kena, Legatus of the First Legion. The Look first? Like Santa I had over no here. idea you had survived. We lost our emperor, our city, more than half our troops. For my wounds, I may never take the field again. But we survived, I. In a manner much to your liking, I dare say. We have no intention of adding to your misfortunes, nor do we bear you any ill will. Spare me, though you children may speak in earnest. Overtures of peace ever ring hollow in my ears. So long as man stands to profit from his neighbor's suffering, war is inevitable. Hmm. Driven from our ancestral home into this blasted waste. Yet still you yearned to rob us of our paltry scraps. It was only with Magitek that you learned to keep your distance. Though we knew it was only a matter of time before you regrouped and returned. Conquest and Empire were our only defenses. Emperors Solus and Varys understood this, and through their campaigns saw us grow and prosper. Solus. Much blood has been spilled in Garlemald's name, aye. But if it is a choice between yours and mine, then it is hardly a choice at all. Mm. I do not deny that a great many conflicts throughout history were driven by the desire or necessity to gain by another's loss. That is not why we are here. Nor have we come to petition your aid in the war with the Telophoroi, grave though that threat may be. Our purpose is simply this. We wish to help you. Let us help you. If there is aught that can be done to ease your plight, we would be glad to do it. Perhaps you would. But regardless of the ideals you espouse, your leaders would not send an army into Garlemald if they did not stand to benefit. If we accept their aid, they will expect their efforts to be rewarded once the Telophoroi are no longer a threat. And after compensation and concessions, the great empire would be brought to heel. Her enemies rejoice at her downfall. Our third eye a mark of shame. We won't stand idly by and let your people be humiliated. And we're not alone in that. We only want to make a difference, to make this world of ours better. Surely you can understand that. What I'm trying to say is, there are so, so many people who just don't care about making you suffer. And maybe that's almost insulting after all the suffering you feel the world has subjected your people to. You know, to. this angle 
Where you can't see her eyes? It just makes her speech so much more Believe powerful. Not, I don't know why. Truth. And now we're here. <clears throat> and all we're asking is for you to tell us what you want. What you hope for. So much blood has been shed. So much lost. All because of this endless war. Who wouldn't want to end it? Can we not work together? To face our problems as one? Answer me this, young peacemakers. Okay, wait, did we actually make some progress here? If a world without <laughs> conflict is your desire, why reject the unity and prosperity of Garlemald? Hmm. Hmm. Is it because we do not share your faith? Hmm. That we do not share your heritage? Hmm. That our ideals hmm. and virtues differ? That we cherish and hold in the highest that which you do not. Disparity is the root of discord, and peace built on compromise is flawed and fleeting. Happiness for one and all is a dream, and the reality is that to the victor go the spoils. Yeah, victor spoils. That is why we Garlians will never submit nor surrender. For freedom and for pride, we will remain true to ourselves until the bitter end. That is my hope. But your pride will be the bitter end. Like, that is literally what will... Hmm. Hmm. It seems there is nothing more to say on I the matter. really thought... I really thought we were making pro. Oh, what's going on here? What's going on here? What's going on here? What's going on? Whoa! Why? No! 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 no, no. Are you fucked in the head? Are you kidding me? You will remain here while I decide what, what to be done with you. Do not be alarmed. No harm will come to you. If you we literally came here trying to make peace. Are you fucked? Nah, that's bullshit. We will not resist. However, as your guests, I ask that we be allowed to speak with the other members of your group. As you wish. I had no intention of locking you up, as by dawn you would be frozen stiff and you're no good to be dead. You are free to move about the encampment, but there is one condition. Collar them. Hey, look, I may be a Miko. Make sure that collar has a bell on it. That's all I'm saying. Let me jingle jangle while I run around. No? Not that kind what of collar? Wait, why didn't I get one? Wait, it's kind of glam as fuck. Incentive. You'll be watched at all times. Stray too far or act suspiciously, and we will administer a rather painful shock. Oh, I know Ray was into this. I know Ray was eating this shit up. Stop. Keep away from that one. The champion of Eorzea is not so easily cowed. Even if she allowed herself to be collared, the shock would be no more than an itch. No. If she refuses to obey, we will activate the twins' restraints instead. You needn't worry about us. Ah, uh, bitch, I will! They're my babies! Don't forget we're even wearing them soon enough. Even now, you still... Why go to such lengths? What is it all for? Because even the most bitter adversary may one day see reason. In the coldest, blackest of nights, meager though it may be, we must share the warmth of our fire. I 
I'm gonna go with option number two. It seems very dark nighty, but the first one kind of reminded me of Emmett, but we're gonna go with number two. curious one. A far cry from the merciless barbarian others paint you to be. Is that why? Oh, that's you will why. Be their oh, that's why. Oh, Take them away. Oh, it's gonna come with me. It's gonna come with me. Yes, sir. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm trying so hard not to like get my my mascara to smudge. It's like already getting on my fingers. <gasps> Fuck. I like I need a moment. Like I need a moment, chat. That like j like literally jump scared me. Fuck. <laughs> you clipped it? <clears throat> He's the only thing. Wait a minute. The counter is at 67. Yeah, and guess how many of those times were because of him? Comfort hard wooden frame portrait. <laughs> my baby. He's my boy. Like, I'm never gonna recover, man. Oh, I'm never gonna recover. But yeah, Fairy, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. I hope it was good. I welcome raiders. My name is Syra, and I'm a Final Fantasy XIV streamer, and I'm having a great time tonight. I'm having just such a good time. Today just couldn't get any better. Fuck me in the ass, bro. Forever a widow. I know forever a widow and not a wife. brought these people just to see you at your lowest. You know what though? Hey, look, I wouldn't have it any other way.
ghost of Orshifon did not like my joke. Oh, baby boy, please stay put. I need you. You gotta stay in here, okay? No, I know it's not the coziest, but it's all I have to offer you, okay? Okay, he's back. Did he fall or did he escape? He fell out, okay? I don't want to hear- I don't- I don't want to hear the slander. Emmett's trying to slide in there? Bro, Emmett got the fucking golden frame, okay? <sighs> okay. I need my emotional support or chiffon with me. I, I need I need my emotional support or Shifan to hang out with me. I'm gonna put him in my boobs. I'm gonna put him in my, in my boobs. He gonna stay in here now. Oh. He heard you were crying and was trying to come to give you a hug and some hot chalky. You know how difficult it is to drink hot chocolate chat? I love hot chocolate. It's my, f it's my favorite drink. <sighs> and anytime I try to drink hot chocolate, now I get really emotional and sad. <sighs> All right, are we good? Chat, are we good? Appreciate the kiss. Wait, who are you? Do we have another fucking friend? Hello! What up, Fade? Oh my god. Fuck. Alright, let's speak with Eulis. Oh! Thank you, Anna, for the kiss. Persone non grate. Eulis has his orders, unpleasant though they may be. As Lord Quintus's instructions, I am to supervise you doing your time here in Tertium. Before you ask, no, I don't have a key or any of the means to remove your collars. Nor would I tell you if I did. And if you try anything, you'll soon wish you hadn't. So do you truly intend to speak with the others, or was that merely a ruse? <sighs> We're in no hurry to disobey Lord Quintus, if that's what you mean. Perhaps you doubt the wisdom of his decision. as you will but remember i'll be watching if i catch wind of you doing anything untoward trying to trick our people into turning their coats and the like the shot collars will be the least of your worries understood honestly the shot collars seem pretty tame now considering yoshi p just blasted me with a picture of my dead husband so you know what do your fucking best oh you're a fan sumi i'll go add you in a second Though we're somewhat compromised, to put it lightly, let's not waste this opportunity. I suggest splitting up and learning what we can of the situation, and above all else, don't use magics of any sort. <clears throat> you, on the other hand, may go wherever, wheresoever you wish, even outside the camp. I know full well I couldn't stop you if I tried, but do not forget, if you do anything to endanger us or our interests, I'll be known as will pay the price. Na -na 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 -na. Say so? Oh my god, I love that Doja Cat song. You 
came at you, didn't you? Well, what if business brought you here? You'd best keep your hands off that etherite. It's activated, but I'd rather you didn't mess about with it. The other... There are others throughout the city built by Garleans. Four Garleans. 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 Could teleport all over in the blink of an eye, provided there was a terminal nearby. These days, however, we use etherite power to keep this place lit, though that comes at the cost of its normal function. Vern! Hello, Vern! Oh my god! Vern, hello! How are you? Oh my goodness. Can we get a shout out for Vern? Oh, we already did get one. <laughs> Amazing. Hi, Vern and Vern's viewers. My name is Syra. I am a variety streamer. Not a variety streamer. Holy shit. That's my old fucking shtick. I got distracted by typing VIP. Um, I'm a Final Fantasy XIV streamer, and I am returning to Final Fantasy XIV after many, many, many months of taking a long hiatus. You just missed me crying. My makeup is holding up really well, mind you. Like, you can't tell, but my eyelashes are starting to peel. And the smudging down here is... is It's getting there. It's getting there. I learned my lesson after Heaven's Word. I have to wear waterproof makeup when I'm playing Final Fantasy XIV. Your makeup game point? Thank you. Skin is flawless? A. I do my best. I do what I can. I may not have beautiful lips like you, but the skin be skinning. I see the, the cry counter. I was intrigued. Yeah. I've been doing a lot of crying. About 95% of, like 90 to 95% of those tears have come from like, like, um, the last two expansions. <laughs> Girl, I understand. Are you are you a Final Fantasy XIV gamer? Who here has played Final Fantasy XIV? Vern, have you played Final Fantasy XIV? Are you a Final Fantasy XIVer? Ah, pool of frogs. You? Hell yeah. Are you all caught up with the MSQ? We're doing Endwalker content, so I'm I'm not caught up. So there may be spoilers for some of you. And the last FF I played was ten. Was ten? Damn, I haven't even played 10. I've only played 14, and uh, I'm working on 16. You're still in a Realm Reborn? Oh my god, this is spoiler territory then. Unless you don't mind. I have it. I just cry a lot. Yo, mood. Vaitis. 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 Vay. Hello, and hi, Traded. Oh, not sure. I definitely played one of the newer ones that I never finished. Was it, um, was it also 16? Or was it, like, the 7 remake? You seem dope, and I think I'm too behind to understand the spoilers. Hey, that's fair. You know what? Like, that's all up to you, right? If you don't mind spoilers, then hey, get comfy, get cozy, and enjoy the ride. But if you do mind spoilers, hey, I warned you. My thing is like, my memory is very bad. So when Endwalker came out, I definitely saw Endwalker spoilers, but I don't remember a single thing. Like my memory is really bad. So it takes a lot to actually like ruin an experience for me. You know what I mean? That kind of thing. I'm not sober. I am. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy your um, non-sobriety. <laughs> Barbie, but hi. Yeah, the username does check out. Well, welcome, friends. Get comfy, get cozy. We're going to get back to the to the story here. These days, however, we use etherite's power to keep this place lit. Though that comes at the cost of its normal function. <laughs> Honestly? I'm so sad, chat. <laughs> Like, I'm like, I'm really sad. Like. <laughs> is it gonna get worse? Like, is this just gonna keep happening? <laughs> It's 
not too late to add a song delete, you're right. Let's just say the music really gets good. That's not, that's not, that doesn't make me feel better, Jesse. Nissan, hi Nissan, hello, and hi Isaac, hello, hello. Oh man, oh man. Oh, all right, let's go talk to some more people. Hello, Sabinyam and Nimanas. So cool. The young soldier is on the verge of losing consciousness. Okay. Hi, Marcel. Whoa, why'd you break your neck like that? Am I that short? I know who you are. So cool. Did they just pat me on the head? Or did they point at me? Did I just get a head pat? So-called champion of Eorzea. Come to gloat, have you? I'll wipe that smoke off your face for the blood of a fallen compa compatriots. I swear I'll... Ugh. Oh, oh. Damn. Tore the sutures. Of all the times. The worst of the lot with within striking distance and I can't even muster the strength. What do you mean the worst? If it weren't for the third bleeding us, we'd be the end of you. Virgilia's treachery nearly cost Lord Quintus his life. But we made our escape, took shelter in a mansion, tended to the wounded as he prepared to strike back, and then night fell and we gathered around the radio in the roar, the terrible roar. The capital was in chaos, but we were spared. If <laughs> you can call this a mercy, mind intact but body broken, a soldier in name alone, I'd cut you down where you just where you stand if I could. Murderer. Bro, chill. Bro, chill. Can I turn this fucking radio off? Oh, am I turning it off? This radio is the same model as the one used as at Victor's spoils. Perhaps it is what saved the soldiers here from being tempered. Ooh. Oh, right. That was um the theory that we had, right? The closer you were to the radios, the, like, the safer you were. Okay, there's one more thing. That's sweet Alfino. Sweet Alize. Let's see. Where do I go? Did someone break up with you in FF Online? No, I just saw my dead husband. <laughs> if it makes you feel better, I just found out I've been cheating on myself. You've been cheating on yourself? How do you cheat on yourself? I want you to explain that one to me. Cry 69 is next? I know. <gasps> okay, what do you think is going to be Cry 69? What do you think is going to do it? Do you think it's going to be Orshi again? Don't ask, y'all. <laughs> it's you, Peppermint. I, I served under Lord Gaius in the 14th Legion. I was on the night the Praetorium fell. You and your adventurers. You killed them. My comrades, my friends. Set them aside in the dozens as though they were nothing to you. Maybe I am too. Just another faceless enemy to be cut down. But it won't be long until our countrymen return. Until you get what you deserve. Mock my words. Oh, I thought she was like excited and happy to see me. Uh, I forgot where I was for a fucking second. I know what it's gonna be, but I want you to be surprised. You all suck! <laughs> Did you learn anything of notes? Yes, can I pass out? I got what I and your findings are consistent with my own. The plight is desperate indeed. The sick and injured are at, greater, at greatest risk. Without warmth and proper nutrition, I fear they will soon perish. I realize there's precious little we can do for them at present, but I cannot bear to see them suffer. Please, will you help me tend to them? Sure. Oh yes, my winter gear. I saw someone in chat mention that I wasn't wearing it. There we go. Flavius? Hey, yo, that's the fucking name. <coughs> Who's there? My eyes. They... I can't see all that well. <sighs> Thank you. The numbness has subsided a little. But I know. I won't last much longer. You should look to the others who can still fight. Give them my ration. If me going hungry means someone else lives to see another day, so be it. At least I can still serve in that way. All right, let's go speak with Alfino again. So those you met fare no better. I was afraid you'd say that. I know we were warned against meddling in their affairs, but we can't leave them like this. 
Perhaps we might gain permission to have the contingent deliver supplies. Finn Bear, thank you for the five month resub. I'm gonna mute my alerts real quick because we are doing MSQ and I don't want alerts going off in the midst of cutscenes. Still a long way to go, but I'm glad to be out of the hospital. Jacko, I'm glad you're not in the hospital. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sending you all my heals, okay? I'm I'm casting Asuna on you. Is it working? Can you feel it? Can you feel the tingles? Have you been healed? Quintus may have made his feelings on the matter quite clear, but even he must recognize they are not in a position to refuse help. Maybe Eulis could persuade him. Then we need to persuade Eulis first. <gasps> Is Orshi getting a head pat? Were you giving Orshi a head pat? He does deserve it. Oh, do I have like anything here that can get the XP? Yo, look at Pepper's ass though. No, I don't. That's okay. Dark Knight will just have to suck it all up. Oh, I forgot to change my outfit again. Fuck. That's okay. <coughs> well, seen enough? Eulis, the people here have barely enough food and fuel to survive. Have even the other soldiers been able to procure any more supplies? We've been scavenging provisions from the nearby houses. As those families keep. Kept, rather. Some stored away in the event they were snowed in. Still, going out and getting it, getting it is dangerous work. We have a lot of mouths to feed. Fuel is the greater concern, though. We had some cerulean set, ceruleum set aside until it was stolen. <gasps> Wait! Can we give you the one that we got? We haven't identified the culprit. Could have been other refugees or one they afflicted for, we know. Either way, we're down to the last dregs. With all the healing they need, those in poor health are going to get worse instead of better. If it's really even need, I could teach you to secure a ready supply. We can have some sent over. We will not accept your charity. Oh my god, they're so stubborn! If we can hold a little while, a little longer, the situation is sure to change. Hi, everything will change. One of your comrades mentioned something along those lines. Those mysterious countrymen of yours, I assume. Nope, top one. Said something of it, have you? <laughs> well, from what I've seen, there's little you could do to interfere, so there's no harm in telling you. One of our scouts spotted a hooded man issuing instructions to the afflicted. On the bastard's words, the Lord of Servants of Tulofaroi, Van Daniel? Then he made his way inside the Imperial Palace, or what stands in its place. We identified the seat of the enemy's power, we realize. Lord Quintus dispatched a messenger to the ex legion as saying saying as much, and instructing them to join forces with the provincial legions to prepare for a combined assault on the Tulofaroi. Once our allies arrive, your contingent will be sent running for the hills. Then we shall reclaim the capital by our own hand. And how do you intend to survive in the meantime? At this rate, many of your countrymen will perish long before reinforcements reach Garlemald. They need help now. Say the word and we will bring you Cerulean. How can you say no to that sweet boy's face? I will speak with Lord Quintus. Yes! Let me help you, you stubborn rats. <laughs> So, did he agree to it? No, he will not place Garland Mold in the debt of her enemies. I have, however, been ordered to search for Cerulean outside. So you are under my watch, you will come with me. Guess we can just lead them to the to the tappers, right? Very well. After all, my hands make light work. <sighs> you a lot more trouble than you're worth. <laughs> Once we are outside, you will follow my instructions to the letter. We depart shortly. Sounds good. Good night, Red. Take care. 
No, I was here to show up, but gotta go to get to bed to help and start at 7 a.m. Godspeed, brother. Thank you for hanging. Good night, Barbie. One of the questions on the forum took me the fuck out of took me the fuck out because why would I say yes to it? What was the question? <laughs> Bye, Barbie. Bye, Barbie. Hi, relax. Hello. Kane, hi. Am I enjoying garlic mold? Yeah, it's it's great. This is it's fucking fucking peachy, man. Fucking peachy. <gasps> Wait, can I attune now? Oh my god, can I attune? Oh. No. I fucking guess not. His park materials. <gasps> oh, we're on the level 83 quest! Mm, 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 mm. I'm making progress! Mm, 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 mm. Eulis finds himself in the somewhat bizarre position of leading ambassadors of an enemy contingent on a salvage mission. We begin our search for in Regio Urbanissima. First location is Forum Solius, a park to the northwest of this station. You are to remain close at all times and act only as ordered. Follow me. Yeah. Na -na -na -na. All right, let me put on my winter gear again. And now we go. <gasps> Who's this? You're hot. <gasps> They're in a cutscene. Oh, <gasps> They're in a cutscene. I wonder what the cutscene is. Wait, who are you? Wait, why is Decimus kind of hot? Wait, are they hot or am I crazy? <coughs> now I know who you are. Peppermint, champion of yours here, yes? Our orders are to give you the run of our encampment. But I have my eye on you. So, what business do you have with me? Oh, I can actually, like, talk to him. Stay relaxed! Thank you for the gifted subs! I appreciate it! So everything I got gifted is out. Welcome to the coven. If your imagine what's in your stay. He's got a steady in space. Maybe that's why I think he's hot. I am Decimus, Centurion of the First Legion. It's my sworn duty to, d d d duty. Duty to defend the God Mold from barbarians such as you. All right. Welcome, you're subbed against your will. I feel like everybody here is subbed against their will. And honestly, good. I love my subbies. Come hither, bottoms. All right, can I get some XP on Samurai? Dude, look at Pepper's ass. Oh my god. What a fucking view. Am I right? Am I right, chat? This is why I play Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, we're attuning? Attuning to the pussy? We are attuning? <laughs> Will I get XP for this? Yeah, I got a little bit. Oh, yes. Thank you. It goes tinky, 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 tinky. Oh, we gotta go in this way. Tinky, tinky, tinky. About to pepper her mints. Yo, we peppering those mints, baby. 10 out of 10 game, right? I know. I know. No complaints. Oh, I discovered a new location! Fuck! Come on, wait. Let's go back to Samurai and see if I can um, soak up some more XP. You know, I I'm swapping for the XP. Definitely for the XP. <laughs> Yo, Caesar! What have you entered into? Yo, we're just attuning to the papussy, bro. We are just attuning to the papussy, okay? You tell me you wouldn't attune to the papussy? Crunchy Spaghetti, thank you for subscribing and for attuning to the papussy. I appreciate it. Oh my god, all my subs are attuners. Oh my god, if you're a sub, you're a papussy attuner. That's it. That's what this is. You're looking respectfully? You don't gotta lie. I'm looking disrespectfully. Oh, it didn't go off. Like, goddamn. Goddamn. Look at that shine on her behind, bro. <laughs> on behalf of a certain DGen streamer, Sniffa. Which DGen? J3? Ponto? I know too many. 
You gotta be more specific. There's no... <laughs> baby amazing fucking incredible alrighty okay where the fuck am I going this way <laughs> I'm iconic pepper you are so iconic bestie What are you talking about? Relax. You were at 170. Oh, my subs. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, we're slowly climbing. We're slowly, slowly getting up there. The goal is to get back to a, like to around a thousand. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You're so hot. Wait, you're so hot. Oh, my God. Look at that ass. Oh, my God. Look at those titties. Look at that under boob. Oh, my God. <gasps> Unable to send more than seven friend requests a d Oh my god! Humming, 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 humming. Do you believe in love at first sight or should I walk by again? Oh, please walk by again. I am begging. I am on my hands and knees begging. Sorry, stop thirsting. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. I can't help it. I can't help it. My husband is gone. My in-game husband is gone. Like I, you know what? My, my husband, my husband literally opened the game, slapped me and left. I have a new wife now. And it's you. With your thick ass, you fucking Thailander goddamn. <laughs> Walk by again for science, exactly. Damn, why are you moaning like that though? Wait, 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 wait. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. This is what dreams are made of, chat. This is why I play this game. This is literally why I play this game. No other reason. Pepper is strong! Pepper is truly living her best life. Already moved on from Orchifant. That quickly. That fucking quick. Wait, did I even... Did I accept your friend request? I thought I did, but it's like... It's still here. What's going on? Make it make sense. See, it says you're on my friends list, but like... Oh, there we go. I need to turn that into a moat. We're getting a Nodder's emote soon. But I need to... Rogue Smiley, hello, what's up? I wish I had more under boob. Yo, mood. I have a lot of side boob. I'll take it. The friend request takes a hot minute. Same. I also take a hot minute. I don't last as long as I'd hope. All right, let's speak with Miss Alize. Oh, cutscene.
So, this is the park. I'm surprised they found space for one amongst all these buildings. Actually, the recreational areas came first. The houses were later built around them. A healthy society requires communal spaces for children to play and adults to socialize. This park was named after the founding father of the empire, the great Solus Zos, Zos Galvas. Not Solus. Not him! Not he! Did we come to extract Cerulean from the wrecked Magitek armor? No, we've already drained it dry. Same goes to the rest of the Machina in the vicinity. My hair flip emote... My hair flip emote is a tier 2 emote, right? I don't know... I don't know how many of y'all can even access it. <laughs> My, <soul. laughs> My one emote emote? <laughs> is it a tier 2 or is it a tier 1 emote? I don't know. I don't remember. Oh, it's tier one! Slay! Oh my god, so we all have slay! Slay! <laughs> oh my god, can we get a slay in the chat? You have my, un you'd have my under boob? Thank you, Kelsey. Tris glams are all about the exposed thigh, but boob good? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, give me Tris thigh. Tris thigh and Tris booba. More than once I've seen Slay. Give me the Slay. I want the Slay. Relax. Thank you for the eight months sub. I appreciate it. Welcome back to the Kabian. <laughs> oh my god. The hair flip mode is honestly so cute. Like, high key. But as this really has been stolen, we must scour the city for every last drop. And while I don't expect to find anything here, I've decided to try one more time in case something has been overlooked. I see. Then with your permission, we will commence the search. Two years since you watched me? Two? That's iconic. That's fucking iconic. I love that. I love that dedication. It is, like, honestly so wild to me how some of y'all have, like, truly been here for a very, very, very long time. I sometimes forget that I'm, like, not a newbie streamer, you know? I don't know how to describe it. I really don't, but it just feels surreal. Three years as a mate? Three? Holy shit, Kelsey. You're clutching a man's, who is, shall we say, a master of slay. A master of slay, indeed. <laughs> oh, I'm Bella. Wait, that umbrella is so cute. That's part of the uh, the event right now, right? I love it. I really do. Hey, mommy. Okay, where am I going, mom? Search for ceruleum in Forum Solius. That's 100 tomes? How many do I have? I have 33. I'll get there. Alright, there's one over there and there's one here on this, like, slide. Oh, it was like a playground. Hmm, that's cute. The contraption is built in the style of Imperial War Machina, armed with a battery of weapons and capable of transforming into different configurations. But on close inspection, it appears to be no more than a children's slide. I love this. Are you trying to tell me that they had a heart? And didn't just make a bunch of, like, war machines? Look, it's a pool! Alright, where's the other one? I saw one over here somewhere, right? Next will be your 10-year anniversary on Twitch. 10 years? Holy shit, Kelsey. Julio! Hi, Julio! Thank you for the 7 with resub! Oh yeah, I saw the earrings. The Cactor earrings, low-key, are kind of fire. Low-key, kind of fire. A cursory inspection of the wreck Magitek confirms, armor confirms that the fuel canisters have long since been drained of ceruleum, as Eula said. Why am I doing the accent for things that aren't voiceovers? <laughs> oh, I got the Moogle minion. Wait, 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 wait. I think I got the Moogle minion. Where is it? <coughs> Oh. 
I swear I got it. Oh yeah, I did. No, that's the bridesmaid. This one, the Taoist Moogle. Oh, I'm taking off my rings. I can feel my fingers puffing up. My account just turned 14 last month. 14? God, I wonder how old my account is. I don't remember when I signed up. Have you ever seen a park in Ayora's yet? No, that's why Garl Mold is better. Okay, but I've seen slutty cat girls in Ulda. So... I don't know what to tell ya. Almost eight years ago for me? Holy fuck, that's crazy. <coughs> eight years ago? I feel like it wasn't even that long ago. The rather small by Garlean standards, the structure is reminiscent of a merchant's stall. Perhaps it was built for children to play a shopkeeper. There's nothing inside resembling Magitech or any other devices that would be fueled by Ceruleum. Okay, there's one more now. How is it a Final Fantasy if there are more than one? Hey, I've been asking the fucking fandom that question ever since I started playing and no one has an answer for me. <laughs> All right, where am I going? Oi. Oh wait, as Gunbreaker. Hold on, chat. Hold on. Yeah! <laughs> Bump up that fucking Gunbreaker gear, baby. Let's go. It may not be like the best for my Gunbreaker, but like we slay. I gotta get a better uh, weapon now. They didn't intend to make more than one, but it got popular. Wait, is that actually, like, it? Oh, shit. That kind of checks, honestly. Because now there are, like, what, 16 games, right? Not including, like, part ones and twos and threes? I don't really get what that app is anymore. Twitter X? Twitter X? Twitter X? Twix? I hope it's not Twix. I don't want to have it related in any way to one of my favorite candies. <laughs> okay, bye. Honestly, Capwow, I don't even call it X. It's still Twitter to me. I don't trust anyone that calls Twitter X. Because the world ends or gets close to ending by the finale. It's the last story of that world. Ooh. I kind of like your uh, your little like theory there that it's like world exclusive. I'm okay, Julio. Had a good cry. As per usual, very happy to be playing Final Fantasy XIV again, truly. It was their final gamble to keep making games at the time. Okay, so I think I did actually hear about that, but like not all the full details. But it is kind of crazy. They were like, yeah, let's make Final Fantasy and pray that it does its job. And well, it fucking blew, blew everyone's mind. It is like, I am so surprised that I've never played a Final Fantasy game until now. You know, it took me to like 2021 to play a Final Fantasy game. bonkers several points of interest i really thought that was gonna say several cutscenes were about to play i literally almost freaked out several points of interest are marked on the map for forum solius the pond children's play area student knowledge heaven none would require the use of cerulean okay so this did not go as well as we had anticipated friends did you find anything Oi! Up there! Did you f Oh, is that a tryst? Did you find anything, babes? No! Alright, where am I going? How about you? Did you find anything? Am I getting kiss? Yo, the tryst just kissed me? <gasps> Hi, bestie. <laughs> court scene, court scene. Court scene, court scene. <laughs> oh, it's you. Any luck? Mm -mm. There's no sign of any ceruleum. Hmm. Hardly surprising, but disappointing nonetheless. 
I couldn't help noticing you gazing at the pond. Is something the matter? What? Yes. I, I mean, no, I'm... It's just... I used to bring my brother and sister here to play. The pond was heated to stop it from freezing over, so like all the other children, they just had to wade in and splash about. Would have stayed there if I didn't drag them out. We'd be, we'd be sopping wet when all was said and done. Every time. And every time we'd get home, Mother would scold us, saying we'd catch our death walking around like that. And the pond was heated. <gasps> Ceruleum underneath? With the Ceruleum powered heater by chance. I suppose it must have been. Come to think of it, I remember seeing engineers changing out a tank beneath a hatch. But that was a long time ago when the water still flowed clear and wasn't this brackish muck. I can't see a thing and I can't remember where the hatch might be. With the machinery most likely broken, the amount of filth in there is probably the only reason it hasn't frozen over. I'd wager it's still unbearably cold though. Eulis, what are your thoughts on magic? I was literally just gonna say, is she gonna try to magically drain and or clear the, uh, the pool? The average garland would jump out of the skin if they saw it, but the first has a few foreign sig signifery and medici, so it doesn't scare me. And I take it you won't mind if I employ a little now. Oh. Alfino, you know, as you have a knack for finding dry wood, why don't you bring me some? Once that's done, a blast of earth fire should do the trick. Leave it to me. You're not planning to go in there, are you? Of course I am. That tank isn't gonna fetch itself. Oh my god! Alize, you mad woman! It's nasty! <laughs> it's nothing so involved as extracting unprocessed ceruleum from a frozen lake, like how the tappers do it. We're talking about a shallow pond in a park, and we have a way of warming ourselves up after. But that's insane. So, fancy a dip? I actually would not like to go in. A little friendly competition might make things interesting. Blasting me as you catching a cold. Step aside while I drink the pond dry. That way we'll find it in no time. Oh, Pepper, you nasty girl. Let's go with that one. That may be the stupidest thing I've heard in a while. And that's saying something considering who my brother is. <laughs> oh my god. She just said I'm dumber than Alf, you know. Ow. Literally... Ow, Alize, after everything I've done, after all the vouchers that I've given you, god fucking damn. I can't fault your enthusiasm though. Let's do it my way first, and if that doesn't work, perhaps then you can try your method. With Alfino's help. <laughs> oh, I love them. I love my twin babies. Your daughter just cut you down. I know. Sh shit. You delve into the murky water, but come up empty-handed. To add injury to the insult, I see you under your damp clothing. Chills you to the bone. Oh, I'm chilled to the bone. Are you fucking kidding me? It do be your own. It do be. Did you see the Cottage Core Shire game coming out? Yes, I actually saw it on stream yesterday and freaked the fuck out. I'm very excited to play it. I do hope it's um a farming sim. I hope we get a hobbit farming sim. That'll be fun. <coughs> all right, so of course, of course the one that all of y'all are at is the one that I have to go to, right? Damn, on a dead dead, huh? She gone. Beneath the water, your fingers catch on what you might think be a, might be a handle. Wep, oh my goodness, hello, how are you? Da -da 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 -da. Pepper, my dear, you are holding nothing. You open the hatch and retrieve a ceruleum tank. Babe, you are holding nothing. Is it in your mind's eye or something? However, your grand discovery comes at great personal cost as you become acutely aware of the freezing cold and a rancid odor emanating from every ilm of your body. Yours will doubtless feel compelled to pinch his nose shut when you deliver to him your prize. 
They called me stinky. They literally just called me stinky. Stinky, 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 stinky. Damn, it'd be like that, eh? Go on, Peppermint. Give us nothing. Slay, Pepper. Slay. Whoop, it has been a long time. You still play no dub? Hobbit farming sim, sim but it's just your neighbors. <coughs> giving you the bombastic side-eyed muttering under their breath. Yeah, but that's the exact Hobbit experience that I want, you know? I'm just raising myself until FF16 comes out on PC. When does it come out on PC? I'm enjoying playing it on the PS5 because, you know... I'm a console girly at heart. Final Fantasy XIV and holding invisible items. They're a more iconic duo. I know, right? I know. Just confirm in development? Okay, well, that's... I mean, that's progress, right? That's still good news. Did you find anything? Ooh, I hope you did. Okay. Rude! I could have died, Ulyss. That's it. And there's still some ceruleum left. Ah, the fire's still not ready. Hold on, I'll give Alfino a hand. Shouldn't we be taking this back underground? Call me Nuldan because by fire am I reborn. And my clothes are mostly dry now too. That was terrible, Alize. I appreciate you recovering the Cerulean, but I wish you'd taken the time to discuss the plan with me beforehand. Despite the way you've been treated in Lord Quintus's eyes, you're still an envoy deserving of protection. Aww. If you were to die on my watch, you would be most displeased. Oh, you care more about yourself than us. I see. Your concern is to be noted, but all's well that ends well. I love my babies. Eulis, you mentioned coming here with younger siblings. Did you grow up in Gollumold? I did, not far from here. My father was an accomplished researcher in his youth, and for his contribution to the Empire wood and estate. He lived well, better than many. What was Gollum like in those days? Everything. It was everything you could imagine. And so much more. Even during the coldest winters, you always found warmth and comfort at home. Coming in from the snow, taking off your coat and sitting down for a hot meal with family, visiting friends and relatives, receiving that same welcome, knowing they had everything they needed, walking down the street, seeing the lights in all the houses, hearing the faint sounds of laughter and song of happiness. And although the summers came and went all too quickly, in that brief respite, the ice would melt and the forgotten grass makes its triumphant return. Gray clouds gave way to blue skies, some mornings, we climbed to the top of the tallest buildings we could find to watch the sunrise. <sighs> Never again. Those rooftops of rubble, those friends dead, and those memories. But if I could reclaim even a fraction of what we once had. Soon, our chance will come. We just need to hold on a little longer. Not me pitying them. Not me feeling bad. Hmm. Ah. All right. Let's see. We got some gloves. No good deed. All right. Let's go. Now that the fire has burnt out, you're just ready to move on. All right, now that you've recovered from your escapades in the pond, there's another location I'd like to search just outside the park. Oh, I'm getting like a small headache, chat. This is the longest I've been at my PC in like so long. Five and a half hour stream? I'm fucking bonkers right now. Don't fall for it. <laughs> I won't, don't worry. Okay, I'm gonna take my headset off just for a little bit. And I'm gonna have it like this so I can still hear. I just like, my head. You're doing great, thank you. I'm doing my best. I'm doing the best that I can right now given the circumstances.
The Syra voice acting is on point. Thank you. I do my best. Q Todd Howard saying it's optimized. Just upgrade your PC. Oh, fucking Todd Howard, bro. Bethesda, bethesda -ing. I didn't realize the park had a little map thing. Yeah, that's what Alfina was looking at up top. Has your bodyguard? We are in it. Thank you. Keep me, keep me afloat. Keep me afloat, babes. I, de I depend on all of you to make sure I'm standing tall. Stand tall, my friend. Oh my god. What a fucking good song, by the way. What an actual banger that song is. It truly gets me going. Literally makes me cry. I listen to it every so often and it literally feels like I'm getting stabbed in the heart. <sighs> Shadowbringers was an experience to say the least. I don't think, I mean, Heaven's Ward fucked me raw in the ass, but Shadowbringers like, <laughs> also fucked me in the ass, but like used protection. You see the difference there? <laughs> Shadowbringers curated depression then gave it back to me. <laughs> oh man. I'm scared to see what Endwalker is gonna do for me. Heaven's Ward walks so that Endwalk so Heaven's Ward walks so that the Shadowbringers could fuck. Yes, actually, yes. As you can see, his face is littered with the remnants of various types of war machina. Well, my comrades and I have recovered the tanks from the less damaged units. Those that took a more severe beating are harder to scavenge. We decide to save those for another time. That time being now. Rather than pry than price them, price them, price them, price them apart, like pry them, prize, price them, piece by piece, it would be quicker to remove the outer casing using compact explosives. With luck, we'll gain access to tanks without rupturing them. But the force generated by these devices is relatively weak. I'd advise you stand well clear to avoid being hit by any shrapnel. Before any even bothering, though, you should check the Machina Ceruleum gauge to see if there's any left. It should still provide an accurate reading, even when the unit itself is inactive. If the gauge is broken, I'll let you decide whether to use an explosive or not. Should you need more, come to me. All right. Understand. Understood. Let's get to work. Man. Still use a First Legion incendiary number 37 on the destroyed Magitek armor to retrieve a cerulean, a cerulean tank. Man. Why y'all got me doing this shit? Do you know who I am? Do you know who the fuck I am? How do I use, how do I, what do you mean? Oh, it's in my inventory. Oh, okay, this isn't as terrible as I thought it would be. Oh, it was empty. Okay, that was a waste of my fucking time. Wait, there was one over there. Aha, your teeth of wool mock enough room to find. It's still half full, yay! Or half empty, depending on one's perspective. Either way, you guys will surely be pleased by your discovery. It's like, look, I did things. Pepper is so handy. Pepper is such a good girl. Mm. Yeah, Pepper literally, is she, I bet she would. I bet she'd get so fed up by like, you know, by Endwalker and be like, do you know who I am? Do you even know who I am? Do you know who you're speaking to? More explosives. Wait, is that what I think it is? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> You've done it again. Truly, luck is on your side. With this, we should be able to refuel quite a few of our heaters. It's time we headed back. Wait here while I go and see how Alize and Alfino are faring. You just want me to wait? You just want me to wait? I just look around all lost, all lost and pretty like? I mean, I guess. Ooh, I'm yawning. Sorry, chat. Oh yeah, Pepper's a brat. She's a good girl, but she's a fucking brat. Right, tatty two dee tatty titty tatty two. Fuck. 
finally escaped the watchful gaze of your keepers, have we? Thancred? Thancrissy? You're in my ear? Don't react. You'll only draw attention to yourself. Sorry, Just my bad. carry on as you are and listen. Okay. After you left with the Garlean lad, Lucia bade a few of our scouts follow you at a discreet distance. We observed you being led into the station, but decided against venturing inside. <coughs> when you emerged some time later, and we saw that the twins were sporting Magitek collars, it was clear what had taken place. Now, as quietly as you can, tell me everything. Okay. The Legatus himself, eh? Now there's a surprise. Eh? Canadian? Confirmed? This is also the first I've heard of a plan to join forces with the Tenth and storm the Tower of Babel. Okay. Is the Tower of Babel my An next interesting dungeon? interesting development. And perhaps the opportunity we've been waiting for. Our comrades back at the camp also received some rather promising news. But it's still too early to get our hopes up. For now, keeping yourselves out of harm's way comes before all else. Whatever demands the Garleans make, indulge them. With luck, this will all be over soon. Until then. Damn, Thancred, your voice felt like a blanket on this cold ass fucking day. They had not gone far. We searched high and low, but no luck, I'm afraid. I might have guessed you'd be the only one to find anything. I wasn't expecting much to begin with. Eventually, there will be nothing left out here for us to safely salvage. For now, this will have to suffice. We should return to the station. I'm excited. The plot is finally oh, thickening again. Heard you'd gone hunting for ceruleum above ground. Brought back a king's ransom. Hardly, but thanks to these three, we have enough to last a little while longer. Well, well, it's not at all as I was expecting these ones. For savages, they seem positively docile. Uh, it's a poor attempt at humor. In all honesty, I'm grateful for your efforts. But even with another night of warmth, there are those among us who may not live to see the morrow. I trust your expedition was fruitful. Yeah, no thanks to you. Lord Quintus! Use what you procured to refuel the armor. But, sir, what about the heaters for the camp? The time for action is upon us. What is happening? My men and I have matters to discuss. In the meantime, you are to wait here. Do not forget, you are being watched. I can get a vision? No. The time for action. What did he mean by that? I can only speculate. Clearly something requiring their Magitech, given what we just heard. Whether they plan to utilize it now, or after they join with the Tenth, is another question.
Will they ever escape this cult? Return to and reclaim the idyllic spaces of which Eulus spoke? Finished your war, Council? Alphino and Alizea are to stay here, as our prisoners. They will be released once your comrades have relinquished their supplies and withdrawn from Garlean soil. Until our terms are met, they will be detained at a separate location. Um, absolutely the fuck not. After everything we've said and done, this is how you treat us. Our allies have but limited supplies. They may stave off cold and starvation for a short while, but what then? You trying to shock them? For now. Keeping yourselves out of harm's way comes before all else. Whatever demands the Garleans make, indulge them. Everything will be all right. <coughs> Have faith. We'll go with that one. I forgot. I was so enthralled. I forgot my my pepperies. Oops. <laughs> Get them out of here. At least he's like, he's obviously had a change of heart, but he's like, you know, he can't, what's he gonna fucking do, right? He has to listen to Quintus. Man. Fuck my babies. Afin and Aze will be fine. Friend, they do not resist. <gasps> Hi, Tris. Okay, so this is like the state that I'm at with this game. The next quest is question mark, question mark, question mark. Do we go forward? Do I accept it? <gasps> is that a Keaton? It's a Keaton. Do I go? Do I keep going? I'm I'm so nervous, chat. I am so nervous. I feel like now would be a good stopping point. Let's make the question mark an exclamation mark. Okay, 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 okay. Alie lacta s. Eh? <laughs> Alright, chat. Here we go. Once again, Eulis has been entrusted with an unenviable, 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 unenviable task. You will accompany me back to your camp, where I will meet with your leader and present Lord Quintus's demands. Before we depart, however, there's something I would ask. Ooh. My game and everything just froze. Are we good, chat? It's Latin for the die has been cast. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, we're good? Okay, perfect. I just had like a little weird like game freeze and then a headset freeze. Yeah, everything is good. My audio is fine. We're in sync. No issues. Yeah, we're good. Okay, let me know. We all had a one second glitch. Okay. All right, perfect. Well, let me know. Let me know if anything gets weird, okay? Assuming your contingent complies, the supplies they surrender will need to be transported here. That task falls to Legionnaires Marcellinus Marcellinus and Octavia. Marcellinus and Octavia will pilot Magic Armor to your headquarters. You are to inform them that we are leaving shortly. Tell them to ask the 
pile for further details in those words. Once you've seen to that, meet me by the exit. I feel like he's good. he's plotting something. They're plotting something. They've got to be. You again. Ask the owl, he said. <laughs> so, that's to be the way of it. After all this. <coughs> I'm ironic that you should be the one to deliver the news. Those are my orders, and so be it for the glory of Garlemald. I am nervous. I am nervous. Something is brewing. They're plotting. What up, bitch? What do you want with me? Ask the owl. So Lord Quintus has reached a decision. I knew he'd understand. But he would recognize the savage as a ruthless, merciless creature. And to defeat him, we too must be uncompromising. I am ready. In the name of Emperor Varus, for the glory of Garlemald, I will fulfill my duty. Okay, um, maybe they're not plotting what I assume they were plotting. This does not seem to be in my favor at all. I've never played Final Fantasy, but is it fun for a new player to purchase it? Sorry, my English is not good. Your English is perfectly fine. This game um, is definitely newbie friendly. Fun you can jump into any Final Fantasy game. And I'll have you know that the one that I'm playing right now, Final Fantasy XIV, is actually free. Did you know that the critical claim. Did you know that the critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Fantasy XIV is free up to level 70, which includes the first two expansions, Heavensward and Stormblood. So, pop off. You only play Destiny 2, then this will be a very nice change of place for you. Change of pace, not change of place. Well, also change of place, I guess. Hello, bodyguards. Hello, hello. All right, let's get going. Okay, there's like no music. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Hello, Euless. Have you done as instructed? The duties involve more than the transportation supplies, don't they? What do you mean by ask the aisle? No, I'm gonna go with the top one. Yes, I'm gonna walk past the bar with a person. Duty is really a simple thing. We have been given additional orders, though. Whether we will be required to follow them depends entirely on your contingent. You and I are in this together now. Whether or not, we have to cooperate. There's one other matter. A place I'd like to visit on the way to your camp. A short walk from here. Follow me. Hi. Hello, Keaton. <laughs> and hello, my wife. Why am I like, I'm getting nervous chat. I'm getting really nervous. My children are like captive right now. I'm heading back to my camp. Then Chrissy is whispering in my ear, like some shit about to go down. Some shit is about to go the fuck down. <coughs> and I'm not gonna like it. And I am not gonna fucking like it. Okay, let's unlock this area. Lit. <coughs> what up, Ulysses? Right. Let's see what Ulysses sweets is soup sweets. Eulis lingers by the ruins, reluctant to leave and reluctant to say, unable to move on. Wait here? Right, we're waiting. What are we waiting for? We're we waiting for Eulis to say something. What are we looking at? This is his old home. 
This is my home. Ah. At least it was, until that night. I was with Lord Quintus when the capital fell, and thus spared. My family, who did not own a radio, were less fortunate. When dawn came, I made my way here. My parents, my little brother and sister, they were still inside. But they weren't themselves, and they... They tried to. And I had to. I had promised to take them away from the capital that very morning, to somewhere safe, to hide until the fighting stopped. I promised. Garlean flag bears a chain, the bonds between our countrymen. A red link at its center, the blood of the fallen, our loved ones who lived and died for Garlemont. But if she too fell, who would be left to remember them and their sacrifice? What enduring proof would there be that they were ever here? If we had turned to your gods, would they have saved us? I'm sorry, I forget I spoke. We should go. Sad. <sighs> it's no use. Believe me, I do not enjoy being here any more than you. But she wanted us to play along, so that is what we will do. Painfully so, unbearably. I've been thinking about what Quintus said, about why no one would accept Garlean rule. Irreconcilable differences, when coexistence isn't an option, only conquest remains. Varus at Gimlet said much the same. Only by uniting the world beneath a single standard would we rid ourselves of the Asians. United as one people, <coughs> one race cleansed of imperfections. A cold and unforgiving vision. And when we fail to live up to their standards, what place is there for us in their world? But the truly sad, truly frustrating thing is how damnably similar it all is to the lofty ideals of Father and the Forum. Non-intervention. Always non-intervention. Protect our knowledge and our people and to hells with the rest of you. And yet, I can see how it happened. Varys and Father looked to their elders for guidance and took their virtues as their own. But for this world was of their making. In who else could they place their trust? All of us lost in a sea of chaos. Searching desperately for purpose and meaning. 
But it shouldn't just be an extension of another's. It has to be ours. It has to be. We all have a stake in this world. No one should be silenced. I won't deny that we lack the experience of people such as Father or Quintus. Perhaps they've come to see the world as a series of problems. And the most efficient way of solving them, to reduce everything to fundamental forms. A stone is a stone, a cloud a cloud, a flower no more than that. Simple descriptions that strip the subject of distinguishing characteristics. A man is a man, divided according to race, creed or allegiance, and to some, defined by such associations. Is that what you think? in my misbegotten youth. But what I believed wisdom was no more than aggressive ignorance. T, I remember a realm reborn, uh, a realm reborn Alfie now. I've learned to look beyond <laughs> the banners and the politics. I remember to hating his guts. individuals with their own hopes and dreams. <coughs> As for my dream of building a better world, well, every day I'm reminded that it is far more complex than I had ever imagined. But it only spurs me onward to find the wisdom and the strength to see it through to the very end. All of our supplies and an immediate withdrawal. These are your conditions. Demands, and you forgot about the airship. Once again, you will leave one behind. It will be used to return the prisoners. Their collars will be removed prior to the exchange. You better keep your word. So in the end, not even father's expertly worded rhetoric could deter you from your chosen course. I'm getting so nervous. <laughs> Not that I thought for a moment that it would. I've no love for violence, of course, but ours is a cause worth fighting for. I just wish he'd realize it too. Sometimes the only way to protect the ones you love is to take a stand, to refuse to suffer in silence. I want you to know I share your conviction. Whether it be on the battlefield or in the debating chamber, I won't back down. I guess what I'm saying is... You've found your own reason to fight. Yes. Yes, I have. God's willing, there will come a day when we can finally lay down our arms and there will be peace. But not until the Telophoroi have been defeated once and for all. And you, brother, will have a vital part to play by your words and I deeds. I better not see a tear. The way. I better not see a tear. I pray I am up to the task. <coughs> There'll always be naysayers. Those who think us fools for even trying. It's easy for learned elites to criticize earnest efforts and assert their moral superiority, all without offering alternatives. Not that their sophistry has ever wounded you. So stubborn and strong, stronger than you even know. Don't ever change, you hear me? If you stumble, I'll be there to catch you or give you a thick ear. Maybe both, for good measure. Thank you, Alizé. I love it.
love my babies so much. I love them so. Pancrosi? <gasps> Estelosi! Slay. Slay. Wait, this is not gonna go well, is it? Oh, fuck me in the ass. The scouts have secured Alizé and Alfino. Their collars were removed without complication as well. They uh. report no casualties. Not for their party, nor the guards, who will wake from their premature slumber in due course. It would appear the situation has changed. I propose new terms. We have information that will be of great interest to Lord Quintus, <coughs> and I wish to speak with him in person. This is either an excellent power move, or we're fucked. No. Oh. Oh. In the event you rejected our first proposal, we came prepared oh, with a second. Oh my god! Hey, bro. Hey, hey, watch it. Hey, 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 hey! Ambush! Oh, we can take that. More are coming. Make ready. Oh, we. We. Oh. We. Uh. The loyal uh, soldiers of the uh, First Legion, proud servants of Garlemald, of the fallen Emperor Varys, shall safeguard these lands from the barbarian hordes until our countrymen return! Uh, stop, both of you! <sighs> This child may be the worst emissary I've ever seen. Oh! We received an urgent communication from the Grand Company of Eorzea. Envoys from the Imperial Army, led by members of the 10th Legion, came to Alamigo and requested an audience. They explained that their efforts to coordinate the reclamation of the capital with the aid of the 4th, 5th, 8th, and 12th had ended in failure. Communication between most legions has broken down entirely. Most of the 10th's conscripts have deserted, leaving their forces severely depleted. Oh, shit. That is why, unable to continue the fight on their own, they and their allies turned to the Grand Company of Eorzea for aid. Desperate times call for desperate measures, babes, Lies. you know. Every word. It is the truth, and I have not finished. The Tenth has requested that we deliver a message to Lord Quintus. Have the ill <laughs> stand down. You have been listening, my lord. What are your orders? <sighs> Inform her that we will honor the tenth decision. Yo! That's the some good development. And now dignity. Hey man, like I said, desperate times, you know? What are you gonna fucking do? Huh? I release you from your duty. Oh. All of you. Oh. <coughs> I take solace, your radiance, in the knowledge you are not here to witness our debasement. What a is grand, this funky ass Italian shared. music? What in the butter boopy is of going on united, here? Of peace and prosperity. You telling me the Garlemalds are Italian? We are ghosts, you and I. Memories of days gone by. Mm. 
Bonds forged in blood. But I will not be touched. Russian roulette himself. Man. Quickly, we have to reach the station before it's too late. And that's two suicides in literally like what two hours? If there is still a chance Holy that Quintus will agree Walker. to a truce, we must <coughs> take it. I just hope we get there before he and his men do something rash. Eh. Well, yeah, about that one. I, I don't know how to tell you this. He painted the walls. We got a Jackson Pollock painting in here, bestie. Damn, Garleans are really like that, eh? Holy shit. Damn, what a terrible day for rain. What a terrible day for rain, eh? Holy. Holy. Man. Man, like we said before, pride and trauma, that'll do, that'll do a lot to you, man. Holy fuck. Yeah, let's uh let's turn in this quest and and I guess wrap it up. We'll talk about it in a second. Oh, yo Badoo, what's up? Fuck. Much and more has occurred since last we met. As for determining what comes next, we must speak with Lord Quintus. Ah, <laughs> bestie. Uh bestie, I d I don't know. This quest is called Strange Bedfellows. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Man, yeah. Going out to the wild like that was... Going out to the wild like that was, they didn't take their own lives. It's prefer to risk it than take help. Wait, what? <coughs> oh, into the wild? You're talking about the twins? Or the, the sister and stuff? I can't believe he spilled his wine and took a nap. I know, right? Man. Oh, I even got the sad Miko ears right now. Let me let me get it back up. Yeah, I mean like that's so sad. Like I don't really have like the words. I can't even reiterate what I said earlier about the the sisters, Lutinia or whatever. And um yeah. Who's Odessa? Who's Odessa? Wait a second. Who? Who's? Who's Odessa? Wait a second. Bubbling teapot. There's a Lollafell here named Bubbling Teapot. Wait. Where's? Who's Odessa? Who's Odessa? Oh. You're incognito. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to blow your cover. <coughs> but yeah, no. Um, no, that shit is sad as fuck. Like, literally, instead of, like, a truce or getting aid or anything, their pride, their pride, their shame, like, and trauma blinds them from from literally from anything else from like any kind of help and it's sad it's so sad 
feel like Quintus was so locked into his worldview that he couldn't even contemplate a world with the conflict he thought was necessary. Basically. Well, that's it with some people, right? It's never gray. It's only black or white. And that's the problem. And I think that's like what makes Alize and Alfie knows um, like little speech so much more like heartfelt too, like like reflecting on it. Because for them, it's like, and for, you know, like the scions and whatnot, it's like no matter what the cost, they will always like aim for the greater good, even if it means like taking an L, like admitting your wrongs, right? Like, you know, we'll use Alfino and the, um, the Crystal Braves as an example, right? He tried to create something good and his heart was in the right place, but he didn't have the means to support, you know, a squadron like that. And it fell apart, and that was an L, and it fucked them over, but, like, it's part of his growth, you know? You take those risks, you take those Ls. <laughs> the proverb, pride goes before the fall, is basically garlands to a T, literally. I think he was even self-aware of that, but he wasn't about to partake in whatever was to come. Yeah, maybe there was a glimmer of, like, self-awareness in that. I mean, there has to be, right? At least in some of those characters. I don't think so for the sister and her younger sister. Definitely not the younger sister. Which, like, makes me sad because I'm wondering, too. It's like, the older sister may have killed the younger sister and then herself. You know how fucking sad that is? And Walker is hard. And Walker is, is rough. I will admit, I teared up. I teared up a bit um, <coughs> with Alize and Alfino. You know? Seeing them like be all like brotherly and sisterly brought a literal tear to my eyes. But like I didn't cry, I just like I just teared up, you know? Man, man, I want to keep going so badly, but it's 1 a.m. and I'm getting very tired. I'm getting super sleepy. Oh, but this stream is so good. So 68.5. Oh my God, are we doing points now? There's still a lot to go. Yeah, there is so much more ahead of me, but I do think this is like gonna be the best place to uh, to stop at. Ah, oh, thank you all so much for the super fun welcome back to FF14. I honestly, I had a really fucking good ass stream. That was fun. I missed this game a ton and I'm glad that, you know, diving back in it was as chaotic as like i anticipated do you know what i mean like i know final fantasy 14 is gonna like tug at my heartstrings i know it's gonna make me emotional i know i'm gonna have fun doing it i'm just glad there aren't like exhausting fetch quests and all that shit and yeah and we got no dcs which we love to see but yeah, thank you all so much for hanging. I know we have a lot of new people here as well. So again, like welcome to the community. Feel free to join my Discord server. We hang out in there a ton and you'll get notified for when I go live and like whatever things I have planned. We will be back next week with Final Fantasy 16 and Final Fantasy 14. What I'm thinking of doing is um, playing 16 on Monday um, and then on Wednesday and Thursday again and then 14 on the Friday. But I might even play 14 on the Thursday, too. I might do Monday, Wednesday, 16, and then Thursday, Friday, 14. I'm not too certain, but I upload my schedule into the Discord server, like, every Sunday and Monday. Like, every week. So you'll know. You'll know when you know. Um, but, yeah. I hope to see the rest of you again next week for more, for more Endwalker pain and what have you. Yeah. Oh my god, I still have to do my dailies. Man, I don't feel like doing dungeons. And we got and we got Gunbreaker to 90, so you know what? We're chilling. 
We're good. I don't think, I don't think it really is that necessary for me to, uh, oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. For me to get it, um, any higher there. <laughs> okay, let's see who's live right now that we can go raid. Ugh. I hope you all had a good evening. Did you have a good evening? Did you have fun? Did everybody have fun? Please tell me you had fun. Please tell me you had a good evening. I know I had a good evening. <laughs> it was good? Good, good, good. I'm happy to hear. All right, we're gonna go say hi to Yuna. She's watching something. I don't know what she's watching, but it's probably related to Final Fantasy Seven. All right. Bye, friends! I'll catch you next week! Bye! Oh, fuck me!